F Zero GX for the Nintendo GameCube. Oh boy, uh, I played it the other day. I was really enjoying this game a lot. Sincerely, um, I really, 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 really like this game. So I'm hoping that I'll stick with it. Uh, I think I will. I did a little bit of the. Oh, here's where it picks. Uh, not a standard and expert. I guess I did standard on Ruby Cup. Shit, maybe I should just do, try to do expert on Ruby Cup and make it through. Because I think if you unlock that, maybe it unlocks like master or something. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna try master on Ruby Cup. Now I was using it was either Blue Falcon or oh, I was almost a Captain Falcon or Deep Claw. I think I was using that. I'm gonna stick with that. Hey Tommy Gun, believe it or not, it's not Quake. Tommy Gun, did you ever see my stream when I did do Quake? Actually, um, it's on my channel. You can check it out. If there's a mod here yet, maybe they'll put a link, but I don't think there's any mods here just yet. Somebody will come in. Michael Michael Motorcycle <laughs> is here. Mikey GDT D G T D says he's sorry he missed the RAF only run. That's alright. Well it's on YouTube, you can see it. Go back and watch the video of it. Alright. So this is F Zero GX. Let me know if the music could go louder or quieter or whatever. This game has good, good music, so. All right, so ne so this is on expert now, so I don't know how this is gonna go, because I, I did this already on novice and standard so far, so. So I'm attempting to get good. I'm kind of, really, I'm really, I'm uh, taking this slowly and doing this a piece at a time. Oh boy. Be careful. I'm gonna blow up. I might. I just may. I'm gonna be on the skin of my teeth here. Okay, I got that one. Ah, oh, I could have used a little more. Shit. What place was I in? 11th? Fuck that. I'm gonna see if I can start off better than that. Thank you, Leah Hex, for the sub, and Volteon657. Thank you, guys. You're a patron now? Okay. Cool. That's cool, Darkfielder. I just posted a thing on Patreon today. I'm going to do a uh, where people ask me questions, and then I'm going to uh, respond back and stuff. Uh, I'm going to give people like probably a few days to put their questions, and then I'm going to I'll, I'm going to do like, a video response. So. All right, so I'm gonna restart, I think. Or maybe, should I try the next one? No, I'm, that was 11th, that was really bad. So, I think I'll just... I wish they'd give you more options in between just to quit it out. Like, I wish you could quit out on every screen, but you have to like wait until you get into the fucking race. Here, now I can do it. Okay. Do I play old games? Sometimes I do. Scoob? Uh, yeah, I did see Scoob. Um, how was it? It was fine. I don't know. It wasn't bad. It wasn't great. It was whatever. It was fine. I don't know. There were some funny parts. Uh, it was better than I expected it to be. I'll, I'll, I'll tell you that much. Um, I didn't expect it to be very good, but it was, it was watchable. So, I mean... I like that it had more characters than just the Scooby-Doo people in it. That made, kept it, you know, a little more interesting. Uh, 
That's cool, Ninja Pizza. Oh, shit. All right. Yeah, let me, let me, here, I can just hit retry. And I gotta be really focused on this when I'm going. Here. All right. But for now, we're doing F0 GX. I'm on expert now trying to get through this, so we'll see. Am I gonna check out the paper ball game that's like the unofficial Monkey Ball 3? What's it called? I haven't heard of it. Thank you, classic guy for the sub. Oh, it's just called paper ball? Okay. It maybe. I haven't heard of it. That's cool. Is it good? Did I buy Cobra Kai Season 1 and 2 on DVD with a limited bandana? More like I can't imagine the last time I bought a DVD. Um, I wonder what the last DVD I bought was. That's an interesting question. The last time I bought a DVD. Many years. Also, it's, it's, it's on DVD. As opposed to Blu-ray? It has to be a Blu-ray. It's not an actual, it's not a DVD, right? Like, really? I mean, maybe it is. Do, pe do people still buy DVDs? I mean, I guess you still can. I guess you still can. I just, I haven't thought about buying a DVD in the longest time. That, that's gone the way of, uh, you know, VHS. It's like... I haven't heard somebody talk about buying a DVD in quite, a, like, legitimately, like, without joking around in, in a while. Yeah, I have nothing left to, oh my god, like 10th? Shit. Oh, uh, I should have hit reset before. Why did I do that? I just want, now I just want to reset this whole thing. I guess I can. I should let me do it, like, when, when do they give me the chance to do that? I just go buy it, I think. Here. Can I do it here? Yeah, here I can do it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna quit and go back. I think if I know I'm gonna do shitty, like right before I'll hit the retry, that's what I'm gonna. That's how I handle this. Now I now I know how to handle this. Right before I do, um, I'm stuck in 11th forever now. Well, I restarted, so. Katamari, the Macy. The gadget DVD? Well, <laughs> it wasn't that long ago. Thanks, T360. 
Can you say DVD like gadget? No, I can't. DVD. That wasn't very good. DVD. See, I can't be asked to do it. It has to just come out. That's the thing with impressions. It's like when you ask somebody to do it, it's never as good. You just have to let people naturally do the impressions. Because I always feel, I always feel like that my impressions sound. Whenever I like, like specifically, it's like, hey, do that impression you do of Krusty the Clown. It's never good. It has to just like be in the moment, and th then it's good. It never sounds as good if you if you like, you know, force it. At least for me. Like my my mind has to be in that in that headspace to do that. That's a better way to start. Dead and confused, thank you. What's up, Erad? All right, so I got first place. Uh, so I, I streamed this game a few days ago, I guess, or whenever it was, a week ago, and uh, I played it for a while. I hadn't played the game in years, and I was really enjoying it. I liked this game a, a ton. I, I had forgotten how much I liked it, um, but uh, I'm no good at it. I'm, I'm relearning the game here, so bear with me. Uh, Atris HB, I don't even remember what that is, so maybe. Okay. I saw somebody say it would be cool to see me get to level 255 in Pac Man. I, yeah. Yeah, that, that would be cool. I wouldn't uh, hold your breath on that one. That'd be, that'd be nice, though. Maybe someday. You know, games like that, the, the real true classics, you know, Pac-Man, Donkey Kong, all those kinds of games. Um, those take real serious dedication of... Uh, being able to play a game over and over and over and over and over like that, um, where like I, I love those games. I love Pac-Man and Donkey Kong and stuff, but I don't know if I love them to the point of I don't know if I'd want to do what you know these high score guys do, where they should they just play those games literally. I did an interview with one of the guys, uh, Wes Copeland, who had uh, one of the highest scores. I don't, I don't think he has it anymore, but for a long time he had it. Uh, the highest score in the world on Donkey Kong, and he just, every day, he treated it like a job. He played Donkey Kong again, and again, and again, every day. And, uh, is that second? First and second, I'll take that. Um, over and over and over. And I think, I want to say, I forget, he says it in the video, I want to say it took him a year or longer to get, to get the score. And that, that means every day, just that game, hours upon hours upon hours, just that game, nothing else. And uh, I think I did the Teenage Mutant, Mutant Ninja Turtle Raphael run in two days. Maybe it was three days. I think two days. 
And um, I'm so sick and tired of playing Ninja Turtles. I don't want to look at that game for a long, long time. So that's about how much longevity I have with games, you know? I remember when I did Ninja Gaiden, I think I, uh, that sub weapon thing, I was playing it for like maybe like four or five days. I was so goddamn sick to death of Ninja Gaiden by the end of that. I was enjoying it while I did it, but man, just, I can't do that. Like at a certain point, I just, I get tired of, of you know, playing these games and I have to move on to another thing. So I don't have that, uh, um, I, I have like a, um, I, I can like keep playing a game for like a good span of time and like going back and going back, fail, try again, fail, try again, but it's, but at a certain point, as the days go by, I can't go probably more than, I don't know, a week at the mo fucking most where I'm like, I have had enough, like I can't play that particular game, I have to move on to another game. And a week is would be a stretch too. Probably like a few days at the most. I get tired of playing the same game. So what I'm really bad at in this game is knocking the other racers out. I, I've been. I did a whole mode where it was like they're showing you about knocking the other racers out, but I'm just, I guess I'm just not used to it because I played more original F-Zero uh, growing up. So what I'm saying is I got to get you know better at knocking these other guys out. if I can take some of these, you know, rivals out. I wonder who it, my rival is right now, actually. Shit, I didn't mean to do that. Did I get him? I might have got that guy, actually. It was better than nothing if I got him. You know what I just remembered? If you, if you do kill these fucking guys, you get, like, health back. I'm gonna fucking blow up. Oh my god, oh my god. Alright. I do forget that. It's, it's a risk, though, because, like, if you don't... If you don't blow them up... Isn't there another yellow thing? Or no? Thought there was. Maybe there's not. No, I don't think there is. Uh, third. So first, second, third. Getting gradually worse. Did I know Ninja Gaiden on NES is also on SNES with slightly better graphics? I have it. Um, I don't like it. Uh, I don't like playing Ninja Gaiden with a Super Nintendo controller, and I don't consider it better. I don't. I don't like how it looks, and I don't like the controls, actually. But I do own it. I do have a copy of it, and I have played it. I do not prefer it, actually. Just because something's in 16-bit doesn't necessarily mean it's. Better graphics. You grew up with the Ninja Gaiden trilogy. Oh, the Super Nintendo one over the NES games, but it's definitely the inferior version of the games. Yeah, it's just... Like, I like that I own it, because it's a... I like the box. <laughs> I, I like that. I, don't, I mean, it's a cool box. Uh... I, 
I just I can't. Just not with that. There's there's some some things you know that are you know, look a lot a lot better. Like for example, I like the gameplay of Turtle, the original NES Turtles, better uh, than than I like Turtles in Time. However, Turtles in Time is a far uh, much better looking game. I mean, that game's beautiful. Um, but I don't really, I don't like the Super Nintendo uh, Ninja Gaiden. No, not that one. Mario All Star is the exception. Mario Art All Stars is a little different because I like. I like both with that. I like the NES and the Super Nintendo. Uh, I think. I think I feel like that's almost just like another option. Like one day I might be like, oh, I'm gonna play the NES version of Mario Three, and then a different day I might be like, oh, I'll play the All Stars version. Let's change it up because they're both cool. I think they did a great, like a perfect job, like updating that. Um, so I like both of those. I don't think I like one more more than the other. Actually, I think they're both great. Actually, that, that's that's one where it's kind of equal to me. I'm glad that you brought that up. Though. That's a good one to bring up. All right, let's see if I can do this. I don't know these courses very well, as you can tell. But I think I did all of those at one point, um, all the Mario All-Star versions, I think, on video or on stream. I, I like Mario All-Stars. I mean, I'm older, so I grew up with the NES versions when I was a kid. Um, I got them like as they came out, pretty much. I mean, I didn't get super. I didn't get Super Mario Brothers like the day I came out. Like I got that with my NES, but I remember getting, uh, um, you know. Well, you guys know all about me getting. I've told those stories before. I don't want to repeat the same fucking things I always say. so good to get that boost power shit.
Do I remember buying my N64 expansion card? I think so. I want to say I got it with for Majora's Mask, maybe? Because I don't... Did you need it for Ocarina at a time? If you did, maybe I got it for that. So I guess I don't really remember. I feel, I, so for some reason, I feel like I got it from Majora's Mask. Or maybe I just bought another one for that or something. Only for Majora's Mask. Okay, so maybe I did get it from Majora's Mask then. I think, I think that might have been it. That's, that's my guess at when I got it. Oh my god, oh my god. Please fucking. I gotta get all the way to the fucking thing. Look at, look at my health. I have no health. If anything touches me, I'm fucking gone. Oh! Oh god. Oh, yeah, dead. Fucking shit. Oh wait, am I not dead? Oh, there, okay. Yeah, I'm dead. Fuck. <laughs> fucking shit. Hard course. Alright. Did I enjoy my TMNT pizza party with James? Uh, a, a decade ago? Yeah, it was fun. So was watching uh, We Are the World in the 80s. <laughs> what? <laughs> I did though. Yeah, sure. It was, it was fun. It was a fun party. The good old days. <laughs> we are the world. the end of this. There it is. All right. There we go. <laughs> Yay! 
Yeah, the final lap. I also want to point out that master players of this game race with zero health all the time. Yeah, no, I'm trying to take huge risks, but... So kiss a little longer, stay close a little longer, hold tight a little longer, longer with Big Red. Thank you, Big J Play, for bringing me back. <laughs> that Big Red freshness lasts right through it. Your fresh breath goes on and on while you chew it. What about the Double Mint Twins or whatever? Where, where are they? Where are the Double Mint Twins these days? <laughs> Fuck. You can literally end in 30th next race and still end up in first overall now? Fuck yeah. Thanks for keeping track. Isn't there an arcade version of this game too? There is. Uh, does anybody know? Can that be emulated? Because obviously I'm not going to have the fucking... Uh, it's AX or something, right? Uh, F0... A AX or AV or something like that? F0 AX, yeah. It can be emulated. Okay. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll, uh, you know, I know he did duo. Um, maybe I'll, um, maybe I'll, maybe I'll play that one day. I was just thinking about that for a second. Yeah. I'd have to, uh, I'd have to dick around with the, I guess it'd be art, just an arcade emulator, right? I've never uh, tried that in an emulator, so maybe I'll do that. Oh, MAME? It works in MAME? Okay. Or maybe like Final Burn Alpha or something like that. Alright, so Metropolis here. So somebody said I can come in 30th now and still be in first, huh? Is this true? So I give, so I just put the controller down and, and win. And talk to my chat instead. No, I'll race. This game is so good. I'm not uh, like as you guys can tell. I'm not. I'm not very good at this game, but um, at least not yet. Maybe someday I will be. Uh, I do want to say though, I feel like this game is a 10 out of 10 game. Like this game is awesome. It's fucking awesome. That was sudden. <laughs> I was whoo, gone. Wait, I want to see a fucking. They do replays, don't they? Can, I want to see a replay of that if it'll do it. Actually. Oh wait, did that just end it? Oh no, game over. Wait, doesn't it won't let me retry it? Wait, wait, wait. It doesn't let you retry it? What happened? You ran out of lives? Well, I can't possibly. I thought I couldn't lose that no matter what now. Lim oh, the limited number of lives. What? How many did they give you? Wow! I thought I had that shit in the bag. You start out with three lives and get one more for every five kills on the track. Oh shit. I wasn't really killing too many either. You're dead now, so how are you going to keep racing? Good question. I guess that's it. That's the end of F-Zero. If you're playing on low difficulty, I think you get more than three. I w I'm on Expert. I'm trying to get through this on Expert, so... I mean, I c should probably do the other races on the easier and complete that, but I'm, I'm just going to try to do this. You hope I do more story on this? I, I'm, I'm gonna try to do all of it. I, I would like to do every, oh, I would like to pretty much do all, all of this game, but it's probably gonna take me a while because, you know. You have three retries on Expert. Okay, the stars on the bottom say how many you have left. 
Oh, okay. I, w I hadn't even been looking at that. Thank you. That's helpful. Thank you. All right, well, now that was, you know, lesson learned. I guess I didn't need them when I was doing it on standard. It's only now that I'm on expert. I'm starting to actually need the lives. Would that count as taking a live away? Let's see. Oh, it does. Oh. All right, well, I just learned something. I didn't know if you retry, it takes a fucking life away. That m makes a difference. Okay. I had no idea. No wonder I was so low. That makes a difference. All right. Now I see what they're doing. Okay. Well, now now I can't be so uh, lenient on using the retry shit. So I get, I should be waiting longer before even bothering to use that. I, get, I need to save that for the like later cups, huh? Or the later tracks, courses. All right. So now now I see. here. Fuck. I don't think I'm gonna. Nope. Fuck, I, God damn it. I wish you could hit start at any point and quit out. There's one thing. Like, right here. Why can't I just hit start and have the menu come up and quit out? I don't like the waiting. That, that, that does bother me. I, and I meant to hit it there, but now I'm like slamming on the fucking button because. Uh, that's the one, that's like the one thing that fucking bothers me. All right. Because it knows that's what you want. Yeah, exactly. So how is this game like Zelda? Asks retro current gamer. Um, ruby cup. There are rubies. Well, I guess it's rupees. So forget that. Hmm. That looks like an octorock. That guy right there. There you go. It's an octorock's father right there.
Did I get, did I get that guy? I never know if I fucking kill the motherfuckers. What are the little skulls there? See the two little skulls under the time? What does that even mean? Again, probably. Second. Still, I still not get skulls. Is your total count of other racers killed? Oh, so did I kill two guys? I was wondering where those fucking where they counted that. Okay, so I killed two dudes there then. Well, it doesn't really matter because I want to take fir first on the, like, the first track here, so. This game is legit one of the most difficult games ever made, a real ball buster. Well, it's made by some of the pe same people, uh, I believe, that did Super Monkey Ball, and that was one of the hardest games I ever beat. Um, that was, uh, I think I, I probably beat that game in like 2002 or 2003, or I was playing the monkey ball games. I beat the first two. Um, those are such good games. I streamed a good deal of the first one. Um, so, so, someday I, I need to stick through that and, and do the whole thing. Those are so good. I remember the uh, Monkey Ball 2, I think it's Monkey Ball 2, the last level being a Nintendo GameCube. And uh, there's a really cool le le uh, level. I don't know if it's Monkey Ball 1 or 2. I think it's 2, where there's a level, I think it's called Labyrinth, which I remember being a really fucking cool level. It was really hard. Just, uh, I think that's Monkey Ball 2. I love those fucking games so much. So that, that was better. I think I killed two guys and took first there. Now we can move on. Two or three guys. That was better. That's what you want. That's what you want. Now we can move on. So it, it, I wonder if it keeps it on screen to the next one. If it's like a tally of all of them. Um, find out in a second. All the skulls. Now, I guess it only does it per race. Oh, I thought they, um... So they get to come back the next race? I thought, I thought actually, if you get knocked out... I guess it doesn't work like that. I thought if you got knocked out, it keeps you out the whole thing. I guess it just keeps you out the rest of that race, but not, like, the next race. remember everything about this. Yeah, boost power.
was it. That was first, right? Yeah. Cool. They come back, but get zero points in the race, so basically you take them out of the ranking for good. Oh, that's probably why I, I thought that. Okay, I thought of some. Okay, so they're fucked then. They're still in there, but they're fucked. Pretty much, unless they're like first every other time. Okay. Cool, all right, that makes sense. Thank you for that, by the way. Uh, Kelsius? Kels Kels did you beat Super Monkey Ball 1 and 2 on Expert? I did. I beat it on uh, Master. I beat it on whatever the hardest thing was. So the the, cra the first one was like you do, the, you do the beginner, you do the advanced, whatever, and then you do hard. And I think I remember the, the craziest thing. You had to do the 50 levels all in one continue to unlock Master. And that took me forever. But I finally did it, and then I unlocked Master, and I think Master was only like 10 stages, but they were really cool. And I remember Master level 3. I remember, this isn't when I was in college, I remember sitting there as long as I did yesterday with that Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle thing. I was sitting there for like 7 or 8 hours. I think I only stopped to eat something or something. I, just 7 hours, 8 hours straight. Master level 3, over and over. And it's this crazy level where you... Like, you fall off this thing, and then you have to, like, land on this thin little, like, railing or something, and then go knock something, like, I, like it's hard to explain, but it was this crazy fucking level, and it took me forever, and I finally did it. Um, I don't know if I'll ever do that again. I, I hope that uh, someday in my streaming career I, I do that again, because I, that was one of the craziest things I ever did. It, um playing a video game uh that's the kind of thing i wish like streaming existed back then but that, when i was when i was in college that was probably the craziest video game thing that i did was it was the was mon the monkey ball master level stuff um and then i think the, i think monkey ball 2 might have actually come out when i got out of college um or maybe somewhere around there anyway and then monkey ball 2 um was also really fucking good. I, I love those games so much. Anyway, sorry. But um, but yeah, but I did I did do that, and it took it took forever, and it's really hard. Remember, like all uh, I see, I get I get them all mixed up, Mon Monkey Ball one and two. But I remember it was, there was like all those like clock kind of like levels, like you know, and then there's like a. Japanese area, and then um, there's like outer space and so much. Um, those games are so good. I'll, I'll 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 come back to those definitely at some point. Really like those. I have them. Now that my GameCube's actually working better. Now that I have this GameCube. See, I I was actually streaming uh, Monkey Ball. Um, at some point, a year ago or two years ago or something, and I think my GameCube kept fucking up then or something. The disc was spinning bad, and I don't know. But but this GameCube has been working good, so not you know, knock on wood. And I know, by the way, you can use a Wii as well, which I have. I also I have like I have like two or three Wiis now, so. I, or maybe I have like two. Oh no, no, actually I might have three. So I got I got the I got the Wii's. I got a bunch of game cubes. But my other game a couple of my other game cubes are like they don't work too great. I'm using the one that works good, obviously. And I've heard that the, the laser or something on the Wii for like playing GameCube games is better. But uh, I don't know. Maybe it's like a nostalgic thing with me. But I kind of I don't know. I like I like having the GameCube sitting right there. It's 
Does that even make any sense? I'm I, the GameCube sitting here, and I'm sitting here, and I'm playing this, and this is a GameCube game, and I could be sitting here and playing it on the Wii, and the Wii would technically be better, I guess. But I like playing it on the actual GameCube. It doesn't make any sense. Maybe that's a nostalgia thing of playing the game back in the day and having the GameCube sitting there. I don't know. It makes me when I play GameCube games on the Wii. I'm not as happy because I, I want to be. I want it to be on the GameCube. <laughs> I don't know. I'm weird. I'm weird like that. I'm a weird person. It doesn't make any sense. There's no reason for it. All right. Shit. Oh fuck. That, now that that doesn't end me, right? Like is. Oh, I still got the retries. All right. Hey, thanks, DevGuz, for gifting stuff to the community, to MoFuggas and Mega Drew. Thank you. Wave Bird is literally the greatest controller of all time. I, I love the Wave Bird. Loved it, and it worked well too. I had four of them back then, and uh, I don't anymore. Uh, but I loved the Wave Bird controller, and I remember, uh, you know, we'd, I'd have parties and stuff, and it was fun to get four people together and do like Smash Brothers Melee or something with four people or stuff like that. It's fun. Wii was actually amazing, but most people think it's garbage. Uh, I don't think the Wii was garbage. I don't really, I didn't really like the Wii Moat very much at all, really. But the Wii itself, I, I think, is fine, and I think there's a lot of good stuff on there, actually. Not the Wii, the Wii U. Oh, the Wii U. The Wii U was great. Uh, the Wii U had all kinds of fucking great games. Um... I don't. I don't have anything bad, really, because because the Wii U. Um, by that point, I played all the Wii U games with like the Wii U. Not like the pad thing. I actually I did not like that. Whatever it was called, the game pad or whatever that I didn't like. But uh, just the the re the games themselves and just using like the I guess Wii U Pro controller, uh, or whatever they called it, uh, was was great. I played the Wii U all the time. I loved it. I, th I thought the Wii U was really good. Actually, I, I think I like the Wii U better than I like the Wii itself. Anyway. No, the Wii U. I think the Wii U. That's a one time my underrated consoles right there. Bam. Wii U. It's not the Wii U is good. Like, there's nothing wrong with it. It's fucking good. Oh, or well, I, I shouldn't say there's nothing wrong with it. There, there's some things wrong with it, but I mean, the, the name is awful, um, and I did not really care for that pad very much. It's called the game pad, right? Um, so that is true. I mean, it it worked, but you know, but. Uh, it just had a lot of good games on it. It's a shame. It's a shame that it didn't do well. They shouldn't just. They should have named it something else. And I feel like they should have given it a different body. <laughs> you know? Because it kind of looked like the Wii. Like when the Wii. If the if your Wii falls over, <laughs> that's what the Wii U looks like. <laughs> you know? And I'm not, and I'm here. I'm not trying to shit on the Wii U because I like the Wii U a lot. But I mean, really. All right, you know, I can hope that this life will come up. Where's the life? Where's the life? Oh my God, here it is. All right. Oh 
God. Do I have any boost power left? Oh my god. Do not enough. Oh my god. Second? Is that second? So now I don't know how I'm doing. Oh, third? Fuck. I thought it was in second. Fuck. How am I doing here? I haven't been killing enough, guys. I'm not really paying attention enough. Alright, so... Oh. Well, Blue Falcon, really, is the only one I guess I kind of have to worry about. Can he even beat me now? I'm doing alright. As long as I don't fucking rank out or something. So I'm, I'm doing alright. Is Aaron done? Oh, uh, I guess uh, Aaron raided me. Sorry, I was into the game here. Uh, thinking about what I was doing. Trying to, at least. Uh, thank you for the raid, Aaron. I don't know what she was playing, but... Uh, I'm playing F-Zero GX again. Thanks for coming in, guys, from Aaron's uh, raid. What's up, New Wave Junkie? Splatterhouse and Bird Murder Game? What the hell is Bird Murder Game? Bird Murder? The fuck? The selection of games that I play is awesome? Well, thanks. I mean, I play a lot of different things. I think a lot, a lot of people get upset with the games that I play. They're like, why don't you play this game? Why don't you play that game? Mike, why don't you play more Fortnite? Nobody says that. Bert and Ernie? Wait, what about Bert and Ernie? No, I want to hear about the bird game. What was the bird game? Leak? I'm not detecting any leak. Hey, man, fuck that. And I know why you're doing it, too. I'm not going to get suckered in. Fortnite stream when? I did, years and years and years ago, I actually did stream Fortnite. One, one time. Well, no, and then technically twice, because the other time I did the, the plane thing, but that's like a completely different game. That fucking Air Royale. Bring it back. That shit's fun, actually. Yes, I mean the game Aaron played. It was like bird something. Something, bird murder? What the hell is bird murder? Aviary attorney? What? What's what system is that on? Is that is that PC Engine? I've never even heard of that. What the, what what is the game? There you go. I think I just got a real answer. Hanataka da oh Hanataka daka that thing. I played that before. That's what you're talking about. Oh, okay. Okay, now I got it. Aviary Attorney. Fucking goddamn. I don't know. Like, I don't know all the names of the PC Engine games. Who the fuck knows? That could be a game. Oh, Aviary Attorney, some weird Steam game? Oh, so that is a real game then. I don't know what's going on. All right, I'm playing F-Zero. Jesus Christ. Ah, oh, and I missed that. Great. Fuck. Oh, oh there's a... The speed things are on that side, though. Uh, I see what they're doing. They're like, if you're good and you don't need the, you know, the help, you can go on the side that has the speed, Mike. See, I don't. What the hell do I know? I 
don't know. I don't know. I don't know nothing! Hana Taka Daka. Daka Hana Daka. Here. Is this it? I need to do this here. Stay here so I can hit the thing. Yeah. Don't have to be so worried about killing these guys if I was in front of them. There's another method for you. You don't have to worry about side swiping them if they're fucking not nowhere around you because you're so fucking far in front of them. be my method. was coming up. Oh, fuck. I did this too early. Oh, my God. Thank God. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. Still in first, but Blue Falcon. Fuck. So I have to beat Blue Falcon. Oh boy. This is not good. <sighs> I got this? I don't think I got it, but thanks. I get two tries though, right? Even if I die? We'll see.
there's a fucking jump there. I can't even tell if that, I don't know if that's even him or not. Now they're all gonna fucking start going like maniacs. Was he ahead of me? I don't know if it was him or not. Fuck. Was it Blue Falcon? I don't know if it was him or somebody else. Who was in front of me? Sonic Phantom. Who the fuck's he? Oh, Blue Falcon's down there, number five? Yeah. Oh, fuck you, Blue Falcon. Oh. I did not expect that. Yes. All right. Well, at least I have a small smidgen of fucking progress here today. Jesus. Something. All right. Oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> Thank you, uh, Stumpus, for the uh, sub, for subbing with Twitch Prime there. Thank you. Thanks for subbing there. It would suck to try to make it to a 7-Eleven in the city. You would have to use anti-gravity to get some beef jerky. I'd like to interview you. What are your plans now you've won? I show her our marriage is. I'm going for a massage. Thank you for the interview. This has been a speed crazy dream extra. Does anybody have any idea what he fucking said? That's it, everyone. We'll see you. And he's got that Birdo snout. Just getting your dick sucked by that fucking thing. <laughs> Sounded like it sounded like Bane. Does anybody know what the fuck he said? Oh, right there. Thanks for playing. That's the same. Uh, see, looks like I swear to God, it's even the same font. I think as Super Monkey Ball. All right, we got 30 tickets. And so there's more story stuff. I'm at. Uh, I think if you go to customize, you can buy shit with the tickets tickets or whatever, right? In the shop. Items. Chapter five. We can do this. Save Jody. Whatever that this is. So I bought it. Alright, so we'll, we'll do a story thing, I guess. Let's try it. Save Jody. Who the hell is Jody? Jody Sweeten? The Federation arrived to help out. Ah, the Federation once again! Only to fall prey to the villain. Jody Foster. 
How many Jodies can we mention? I think I'm out. Are you all right? Wait there! I'll get her out! Blue Falcon just turned into Batman. Jody! Jody! Get in the bat trunk! Really? The bat trunk? Is that what you call it? Yeah, everything's bat something or other. Just get in. Can I get in the passenger seat? Uh, I got Taco Bell in the passenger seat. Just get in the trunk. The power plant is going to blow. Escape within 50 seconds. Let's see what we can do. Wah, 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 wah. Enjoy, Mike. Oh, great. Is this going to be not... This is going to be tough? Probably, huh? Probably should have put it on Matt. Uh, the hardest... Uh, or the max speed, I meant. Whatever. I don't know what I'm doing. What was that? What was the what was the green thing? What are these green things? Uh, what do you do? Oh, am I supposed to like be on the wall? There. Here, let me restart this. Also, what are the green things? The green things are energy. Oh, it's like just to get your... Oh, I see it. Yeah, okay. Now I see it. It all is making sense now. Oops. All right. Okay, okay, okay. I gotcha. I see what they're doing here. So you're only getting a little bit of energy back with that, huh? And now, is this the side one? Oh boy. I'm not gonna get all of them, am I? Oh boy. Oh boy. I made it. I don't know how much further there was. Thank you, Straight Cash, for that tier one sub. Is F Zero Zero or Mario Kart your favorite racing game, Mike? Ah, uh, they're two different things, man. I like them both. Um, I don't know. It's another one favorite question. I like both of them is my answer, and for different ways and different reasons. And, you know. Two different things. Oh man, fuck that. Let's try that again. Oh, 
Oh, yeah, I guess that number on the top is counting down how much further left there is. That's true. Shit. Good point. No, 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 no! Oh, God. Damn it, God damn it. <laughs> Nintendo Ninja? What? What's your f favorite episode and your least favorite episode? What is your favorite? Wait, wait. Favorite episode of your least favorite Star Trek series? Uh, well, my least favorite Star Trek series would probably be Picard. Uh, and my favorite episode of it? I don't know even the fucking names of them. Because I don't care. <laughs> so, I don't want to know the fucking names of them. And I know the names of, you know, episodes when it's fucking good because it's worth memorizing. It's worth remembering. You know? I remember Amok Time. I remember, you know, fucking Tapestry. I remember Best of Both Worlds, you know? I fucking remember whatever the fucking sheer fucking hubris whatever the fuck have you all heard that I like Earl Grey tea has anybody heard that I used to do a series in the 80s where once in a while I'd, rem I'd mention that I like Earl Grey tea has anybody heard hey I drink it I'm English. Um. Fuck. What other, whatever other surface characteristics can we mention before this episode's over, so that you can go? Yeah, I remember that. <laughs> I picked out something that I remembered. Dog shit. That fucking show. Dog shit. That show is dog shit. Yeah. Chateau Picard. Yeah, he is French. French. Yeah, he has the vineyards, and in, um, fucking, uh, what's it called? God damn it. Um, what's the name of the episode? He's captured by the Borg, and then, not brothers, oh, family, the episode's family, and then he goes home to his family in France, he's at Le Bar, France, it's a good episode, too, where he's sort of being, uh, you know, remembering what it's like to be a human being again, and all that. This is hard. Like, it's like, now I just want to fucking do this perfect.
damn it. It's like... It's harder than it looks. It... Like, you know, first glance I'd look at this and be like, oh, that can't be that hard. Because I can't fucking get through it. There's those things again. At least I made it to those. I'll get it. God damn it. Is gonna be the damn it. This is a really fun level though. I don't mind doing it over and over. What am I doing? Took me many more attempts than I should have. Chapter six has arrived at the shop. I probably don't have the money for it, right? so I probably gotta go back to the um, regular thing. Where's the Joker? You'll never find him, see? You'll never. Where is he? Save Jody's done. Oh, and then you can choose to do it on hard. That's cool. Um, I want to see how many tickets I have right now. I have 47. Oh, I can buy it. Black Shadows Trap. Let's buy it. Had enough. Black Shadows Trap. Shouldn't we be using Judge Dread quotes for Captain Falcon? Well, it's Blue Falcon. And Dynamite. No, I have Blue Falcon and Dynamite on my mind because I just watched the Scoob movie. It's not. Simple as that. And Blue Falcon wasn't even really in the movie. Blue Falcon, uh, well, he's kind of in the movie. It's like his son in the movie, not like the real Blue Falcon.
keep it over 700 hours. So this is the movie speed. All right. Okay. We just said the same thing. <clears throat> Another fun level, right? We'll see. Oh, fuck. Why? Wait, what? Why does it give you three seconds? Shouldn't it just explode? It gives it. Oh, so it's like a three second thing and then it explodes? They, so they give you no time to save yourself? It's like, wait, what? See, like, I, I would think if at any point it goes below 700, it would just explode. But it's like, I guess if it goes below 700, then a timer starts for three seconds, and then it explodes. And in that three seconds, you can't save yourself. So why even have it take three seconds? Why not, why not have it just automatically explode? That doesn't make any sense. See, like this. Like, I have three, you should, there shouldn't be a timer. Why is there a three second timer? If they're gonna give you three seconds, then it should, um, they should give you like those three seconds to like work your way out of it. Otherwise, just have the fucking thing explode. That's stupid. Anyway, that's just not how it is. If you go under 700, then a three second timer begins and then you explode. So fine, fine. I don't, I don't agree with that, but I still hate this. No sir, I don't like it. And there we go. And, and there's nothing I can do. Let me just wait three seconds. That's going to just piss me off. You can still get to the end before the mission there. Oh, like if you're at the very, very end of this. It gives you the three seconds for if you're at the very, very end, maybe. About to cross the finish line or something. Is that how you're saying? Okay. Well... It makes a little more sense now. I still think it's weird, though. How about you not hit any of these? This is gonna be hard. Is that all the way in the red? That's like all the way at the bottom, huh? All right, so I'll just take a little bit slower then, actually. I just can't hit anything, man. Wait, what? Why is it going off? I just, I don't know how low the... I don't know how low the bar is. I thought, I don't Constantly 
same line. Okay, this is just annoying. supposed to do there god damn it they do on the harder level on this to if there is a harder level on this I, I, there probably is to make it harder probably uh, more obstacles maybe Less, um, probably more obstacles more cars on the road or something right, where is this fucking dirt gonna come into play I'm not sure Uh, 
like after this shit, right? I'm watching. came up on me before and I was like, I just didn't know it was going to be there. It's after, you know, it's after this shit. Son of a bitch. I'll give you dirt. I don't know what that means. But you're getting it. You're getting the dirt. You're gonna be six feet under, if you know what I mean. I should not have done that right there. That was not good. Why did I do that? I probably need that. No, fuck. What am I? No. Right. Fuck. Get <laughs> that. <laughs> that. Tyson's punch out is such a good fucking game. I know this is the most random thing to bring up right now. But Mike Tyson's punch out just popped in my fucking head. I fucking love that game. When I'm playing video games, I'm thinking about video games apparently. I have fight problems. I have fucking problems. I was, thinking, I was thinking about fighting Tyson. It's fun. It's like a fucking fun good game, man. Okay. There it is.
So far, so good. And Don Flamenco can go fuck himself, by the way. It's like that last turn. I got a, apparently a, that right near the end, there's some some kind of crazy turn that happens right at the end, I guess. Is that what got me twice in a row now? Something happens right at the end. Some kind of really sharp turn or something. But somebody should clip that so I could watch that in slow motion later. Right that, where I died right there, there was... Oh, I wish I could see what happened. It happened so quick, I don't even fucking know what happened. Something, something that comes up really fucking quick. I gotta be, like, ready for it, and I don't even know. I didn't even, I didn't even see what happened. It's like a, it's like a car accident. It's like, I, I can't even tell you what happened. They say, well, what happened? I don't know. I don't know what happened. Sir... I didn't see it. <laughs> I didn't see shit. You're asking the wrong guy. If I knew what happened, I would have fucking done something about it. Fuck. One second I was driving my car, and the next second I was fucking blown up in a ditch. And I like, I, the fuck, man? I don't know. I have no idea what happened. All I know is next time I get in my fucking car, I'm gonna be going 950 miles per hour. And when I see dirt, I'm gonna fucking hit the fucking gas. What happened to Mike? Uh, he saw dirt. Fuck! It's like... Fuck farts! Fuck! Fuck! Ah! Blah. do this fuck this level fuck Don Flamenco See, the problem with this is I fucking, you have, you have to have patience, and the more pissed I'm getting, the less patience I'm having. It's working against me. The more I do it, the harder it's becoming, because I'm getting angry, and you need to have be fucking focused and calm, I think, to do this fucking level. I'm not calm. I'm not fucking calm at all. There's no part of me right now that's fucking calm. None. Zero. Zero. Zero percentage is calm. Angry. 
fucking angry. Well, if these games piss you off so much, then why do you play them? <laughs> You wanna know why? Cause fuck you. That's why. <laughs> Fucking asshole. Well, if he hates playing video games so much, then why does he play them? Sack of shit! Alright, let's just get it together. Calm down and get it together. What we need here is a sense of composure. Not acting erratically. Concentration, composure. And if that doesn't work, then I'm just gonna get really fucking ang angry, I'm gonna go crazy, and then I'll beat it that way. One way or the other, I'll get through it. Usually with me, I go crazy, and then I usually beat it. That's usually how it happens. It's, it's seldom I go the calm, cool, and collected route. You know why I don't? Because I don't like it. It's not fun. I want to yell at the game and call it names and tell it it sucks and tell it it's an asshole. To rip the game's fucking heart out of its fucking chest and eat it. meters was that 182 so like how many seconds is that 
how, like how many more seconds would I have would I have had to have gone to win that? Less than a second. Now, if you would have said like four seconds, I would have been like, all right, well, a little bit more. One fucking second? Are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? Watch that last step, it's a doozy. <laughs> that last turn fucking gets me. Every fucking time. God. Who is that announcer? Find him in the game. He's in one of these buildings with a fucking bullhorn out the window. You fucking... Sounds like my fucking heart's on a fucking monitor. I'm ready to pull the fucking plug. I'll pull the fucking plug right out of the fucking wall. Please. Better not. giant bold letters do not resuscitate <laughs> fucking print that's legible Fucking mistakes. Fucking level. Now I gotta go through the fucking dirt. Alright, here's the thin part. God fucking damn it. Fuck you. Fuck you, motherfucker. Don't fucking fuck with me, you fucking piece of fucking shit. Dirt, one. Don't. Okay. All right. Good, 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 good. No! No! Ah! Jesus Christ! No! Oh, 
What did I do? Ah, ah! I'm out of control here. Yeah, see, I gotta get a handle on what I'm doing. It's fucking crazy. Whoa. I don't want to, I don't care, like, I, like, I probably should be, like, hitting those fucking things. I'm purposely not hitting them. I don't want to fucking go too fast here. I hit the fucking wall, you know? I'm trying to take it relatively slow. Any corners or anything. Go pretty slow. hitting the walls isn't quite as much. Still hitting them, but quite as bad. Alright, dirt's coming. Ooh, oh my god. Okay. What have I gotten myself into? I should play a nice, calm game of, what's something easy? Hmm. I don't know, Mario 2. Nice little game of Mario 2. Princess, fucking pick up the egg and throw it at Birdo. Jump on a little ninji or whatever they're fucking called. Shove a rock up Claw Grip's ass. Toss a bomb at the Mauser. Whatever. Feed Ward a couple carrots and a radish. Fine. What the hell is this game? What have I done? What have I done to myself? What am I doing? What the fuck? Well, I'll tell you what. I know one thing I don't want to play. Burn to the ground! Burn to the ground! Burn to the ground! Burn to the ground! That game fucking sucks. That game fucking sucks. Alright. Here we go, here we go, here we go. No, 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 oh, no, 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 That was not good. No, 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 no. Okay. And dirt. Dirt's around this, around this, around this is dirt. And dirt. Dirt. And dirt. Okay. Good, 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 good. Okay, come on. Let this be our final battle. It's just that last, like, spin thing that it does was fucking me up. Probably because I was going way too goddamn fast. Oh, fuck that. 
the story of Zero Grand Prix has arrived. You can purchase at the shop. Chapter 7. Alright. If I have enough credits, that is. Oh, oh. Clonk. Did that just like smash his fucking head off? It was like hereditary. Fuck. Captain Falcon just lost his fucking head. Let's see if we got any tickets. Did we get any tickets? Did we get any tickets? Let's see. Oh boy. 32. But it's 50. Well, fuck me then. All right, well, I guess it's time to begin the Grand Prix. Uh, would I get tickets each time I do? Uh, now I got a question for the chat. So I could just, I'm not going to jump right to expert, but I haven't done the, I don't know the name. There's Ruby and whatever, probably Sapphire or something. The, if I do one of the other cups, does, do you get tickets for each one of these? Like... Or is it, should I just go right to standard, basically? Does anybody know if you get tickets for every one of these? You can grind tickets if you want. Okay, so I could, so then I should try novice since I've never done it. Or I've done it in my life, but like not in the last week since I started playing again. All right, I guess I'm, I'm gonna start novice then. All right, so we're gonna do sapphire and emerald. Sapphire and emerald. All right. All right, we'll start with that. Deep claw. And then we'll go through them. We'll do novice. We'll do standard, and then we'll do expert. make games like this anymore. Isn't it fucking cool? Does the, one of the tickets let you into Willy Wonka's factory? Does it, one of the tickets let you in? Oh, maybe we go to get some chocolates. Is that what the tickets do? I never thought my life could be anything but catastrophe. But suddenly I begin to see a bit of good luck for me, cause I got the golden ticket, motherfucker. I got the golden ticket, Charlie. Very 
Luca. Violet, you're turning violet, Violet. Oh my god, it's Rob the Robot. What the fuck? Get out of bed, Grandpa Joe. You lazy sack of shit. And that motherfucker, the nerve of Grandpa Joe. Can I fucking tell you about Grandpa Joe for a second? Motherfucker lays in bed for whatever, 30 years. The whole family is poor, no money. They, they, they can't afford fucking anything, nothing, poverty. This poor fucking kid living in a fucking shack. One day, gets fucking really lucky. Gets something, gets a ticket to go, who knows, be fucking rich or whatever. You get, you get a chance at fame. Comes home, grandpa, grandpa. Would you try to get out of bed and, and go get rich with me? Oh, oh, what, rich? Uh, fucking jumps out of bed, singing and dancing. I got the golden ticket. Get the fuck out of here, Charlie. This is my ticket. Fucking asshole. This is everyone's Grandpa Joe take? <laughs> I guess so, right? But isn't it true? Right. I'm sure, I'm sure everybody has the same opinion. Because it's true. How can you not have that opinion? The motherfucker. Like, what a fucking piece of shit. You know? I don't care if other people have had the same opinion. It's the truth. That's why other people have had the opinion. Because it's fucking true. He's a fucking piece of shit. You know? And I watched that movie as a kid. I didn't really pick up on that part of it watch it later, I'm like, oh, Grandpa Joe's a fucking asshole. Like, fuck Grandpa Joe. He doesn't, de he doesn't de deserve fucking shit. And by the way, Charlie doesn't deserve fucking shit either, because he's fucking stole fizzy lifting drink. If you steal, you get nothing. You lose. Good day, sir. And then they get in a fucking elevator that flies in the fucking... What the fuck is, is even happening in that movie? This fucking elevators f flying and shit? Fucking guys with the fucking green hair? And I, I don't even fucking know. Fucking goose. Goose, goose is laying eggs. And who the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck is that movie all about? Remember the f scene with the uh, fucking... Uh, What's it? The um, the boat and they chops the, they chop the fucking chicken's head off. <laughs> it's like, what the hell does that mean? Does that have a meaning? None of it's real. It's all in Joe's head. <laughs> He's just in bed. <laughs> that makes the movie a lot better. He's just laying in bed, like, <laughs> like, dream, like dreaming the whole thing up. <laughs> Uh, that, okay, if you look at it from that perspective, <laughs> the movie is, or, or the book, whatever, is ten times better. I'm, I'm going to look at it that way from now on. It's just Grandpa Joe in the bed. <laughs> just thinking, thinking the whole thing in his fucking head. Who ever heard of a schnozberry? Schnauzberry, lick the fucking wallpaper. Fuck. We are the dreamers of dreams. We are the music makers.
Grandpa Joe almost cost him it all with the Gobstopper as well. Oh yeah, he like he fucking uh, goes to steal it or whatever, right? It's, I haven't seen it in a little while, years or whatever. I forget, whatever. Why are we talking about that? The fuck are we talking about Willy Wonka for? The fuck cares about Willy Wonka? It has nothing to do with this fucking game. Johnson says he forgets. I forget too. Enough of that shit. Oh, I remember this course. Holy shit, I haven't seen this in fucking like 18 years or something. Oh my god. Wow, this just blew my mind. Wow, I have not seen this in such a long time. Man, I love this game. It's like Endor. yellow car in this that's in the first F-Zero. We got Captain Falcon. I've seen the green car. I've seen um you know, obviously Captain Falcon um and I've seen Samurai Goro. The, I've seen like the pinkish car. You know the yellow car I'm talking about from the SNES F-Zero? I don't know if I've noticed that car in this. Did they get rid of that? Oh. I can't look at the shot yet. I, I, it's probably in here, right? I don't, I don't, if it is, I don't know if I've noticed it yet. And what was his name, anyway? The guy with that yellow car. He was always, like, in first place, that motherfucker. That fucking yellow car. Everybody talks about, like, all the other cars. Nobody talks about that yellow car. The yellow car was always the motherfucker who was in first place. Fuck that guy. You fucking yellow car. I'll fuck that motherfucker up. Dr. Stewart. That's his name. That motherfucker. Is he in this? I think it was Dr. Stewart. Pretty sure. Uh, I think that's right. Does anybody know though? Is that yellow car? Is that in this game? The game F Zero G X. Okay, Neck Neck Reduce says yes. Yes, he is in this. Says Arwig. Okay, he is. The yellow piss car. Okay. Wait, like, look, Mad Wolf. Is it Matt? Crazy Bear. Fire Stingray. Oh, Golden Fox. That's it, isn't it? Isn't it Golden Fox? So he's in 25th? What, is he stuck in this one? Look, well, Captain fucking Fire Blue, Blue Falcon. Blue Falcon, Captain Falcon. Who the fucking get that confused? Hyperspeeder. Yeah, that's that's it, isn't it? Golden Fox? Yeah, that's, that's it. Alright. So it's there. I needed to know. Falcon, Captain Falcon, Dino Mutt. Golden Fox, Golden Shower, but I'm bump. Long Pipe.
like that joke Data tells. But I'm bummed. I'm, I'm never gonna remember the fucking joke. I think Joe Piscopo was in that episode. into a doctor's office. Shit. Oh, fuck. Get out of the way! shower. Oh! Can I make it to the... Oh, God. Thank God. Thank God. Thank God. All right. Well, we have a little bit of chance left then. Come on, baby! into a doctor's office. The doctor tells him, you need an operation. Guy says, I got a second opinion. Doc tells him, okay, you're ugly too, but I'm bomb. Something like that, right? There you go. Thank you. How does F... I don't know how. He, he, he hump. Okay, thanks for being in there, uh, Atris, HB. Thank you, Alraz. Uh, there's one more mute city here. One more lap here. Leak? I'm not stacking any leak. All right, here we go. So this is like level one in F Zero, the original, right? Mute city. Classic here. As classic as it comes. Hey, this has like a lot of jumps and shit or whatever. I don't remember this. Oh! Hey! 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 Ah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Me. Yeah! <laughs> oh, 
Fuck that. That only screwed me up. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh! Shit, pickles. Wow. You're fucking nuts. Let's go. Jumps just right out into nowhere, nothingness, death. Death! Make it! Make it! Just barely. Was that a snowman? Was that a snowman? What the hell's a snowman doing in Mute City? What the hell was that? I need to see that again. It looked like a snowman to me. Probably was something completely different. I want to see that again. I'm never going to see it again. That's why we do video. It's nice to have things captured on video. I wonder what the fuck it was. Whoa! Pah! Oh, it's going to come. Uh, right there, that thing, that thing, that, 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 that. It was Olaf! You see, I'm not crazy. I swear to God, it was fucking Olaf. All right, final lap, final lap. What the hell's Olaf doing in F-Zero? In summer. Oh God. Frozen. It, it was a it was a snowman, right? Isn't that a was it a snowman that picture that sign? I, the first time I went by that, I was I was like, looked like a snowman, but it was probably just like a building or something in the background. And then I went by it again, and I'm like, oh no, that motherfucker's a fucking snowman. I'm not crazy. Five hundred points. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Fuck a rabbit's foot. Mike had an entire rabbit encased in his coal in these last two races. I, yeah, I you know, I've been getting lucky. I mean I died a couple times though. Wait, this was no novice? Yeah, that was novice so far. Next I gotta do. See, I'm, I'm going step by step. Day by day. All right, let's see what he says. Why did you become a racer? Congrats on your victory. Nice F-Zero machine. All right, let's, all right, nice F-Zero machine. That's a great machine you got there. It's a second hand machine, but it's a jam I'd love to ride in that kind of machine just once. It's a second hand machine, but it's something. Can't, can't understand them. It's a second hand 
machine. But I don't know. Thanks for playing. Right. I've been unlocking cars, haven't I? Have I been unlocking cars? What was the G4 thing I just saw? Let's see. It is, it is, it is, what? Garage. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want to do that. Get, get out of here. Uh, machine? So I can buy, I can buy all these, these other cars. Um, but I don't want to waste my money on that shit. Really, right now, some parts, items. Let's just see. Items. I can buy that. Grand Prix. Oh, I still don't have enough money for that. Shit. I guess it's a good thing I did the novice thing then. Fuck. So I then. All right. I still have to do more Grand Prix then. All right, so now we're gonna do a standard. See, I wanna get all the stars, so. All right, so now we're gonna do, uh, just move it up a notch and we're gonna do standard. <sighs> typhoon is a good car? Okay, uh, well, I'm just trying to get tickets too, but I'll, I'll buy the Typhoon eventually. For now, I'm gonna stick with this, I guess. Thank you, Matt Kimura. All I heard was Yeah, basically. Can you spin attack in this F Zero? Yeah, you can, and you can side swipe. I just suck at it. Okay, I'll try to do more of that here and there. I'm gonna need to eventually. <laughs> so hard. Did I get anybody? Hey, I got two of them. Ah. Uh. Fuck. Smash Brother stage. Was that the stage they used from uh, what? Uh, Smash Brothers Brawl was it? Smash Brothers Brawl. Well, it's Big Blue. I mean, it's like the really famous one anyway. So of course they probably use that, right? Did they ever do any other F Zero stages in Smash Brothers besides that the, that one? Like in any other? Because I didn't really play some of the later ones much. Like in the new one, what's it Ultimate or whatever? Did they do any new Smash Brothers stages or or I mean uh, F Zero stages?
stabs first. <clears throat> Thanks, games, for coming being in. Put a pretzel on my car. I wonder if I could do that, actually. They have, like, different, like, emblems and shit, right? I should look at the decals and shit, right? Big Blue is the name of a world in the F-Zero universe. It's a gigantic aquatic planet. Oh, okay. I thought it was the course. Okay. Thanks, Joshua. You can do pixel art. Ah. Uh. Retro current game where somebody else can answer that. I've answered that many times. Who can be the first? <laughs> because I know I have explained that many times. Nothing from X or classic in Smash Brothers. Hyper Speeder is a great car. <clears throat> Alright. Next. Yeah, du Duo made it, so he'll answer you. out. I get him? Oh! That was a, I think I got the top, the front guy. Okay, that's a big deal, if I did. Fucking tell me I fucking killed him. Fuck him.
Those are one of my favorite things, uh, duo. That's kind of... Thanks, Shishi. Sent to fifth place. This is the best F Zero game ever. It's like it's so, it's so good. It's so good. This. All right. So. All right. So he's. So the bull. This is the guy. <clears throat> Imagine this, but online. Yeah, you have one frame of lag, <laughs> and it would be over. You'd have to have perfect internet. Or next to it, you know. Or not like y you even, like the fucking, the servers or whatever. You don't have to be like flawless. All right. Be awesome though. Sounds cool. What the fuck was that? Ah, what, 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 what? Did you see that fucking shit? Oh, it's on now. That's the what said like Donkey Kong. <laughs> Sorry. Oh no no. That's not even him. Oh, he's in like fifth right now. Fucking, I want this other guy to fucking take for our uh, second. I mean. Is this a bomb or something? Fuck. Not good. Alright, he's in that he was in like fourth, right or something? Let's see what place he's up. I think I'm like I'm doing I'm having a good time here. He's fourth, right? Is that him? I don't know what they all look like. Yeah. Yeah, so. So I'm in pretty good shape. Okay. Cool. Raph only is F0. Yes. Oh, so if you guys are just joining, by the way, um, sorry, I'm like really like fo focused on this. I'm having a. I'm having a good time. I really enjoy this game. Um, right now, I'm gonna be uh, uh, jumping right into the long pipe here. It's gonna be a lot of fun. But yeah, no, so if you're just joining, I'm doing a uh, RAF only run of F Zero. Um, it's tough because Shredder usually. He, he's in first place a lot, but if, uh, if you use the right car, if you use the, like the uh, Dimension X car, uh, which is tough to get, there's a specific place to find it. 
in the sewers. And that's what this pipe is. This pipe leads, you know, to the sewers, which is the ne whole next area. It's area four. But area four is not too bad because there's two pizzas to get, so. And as always, this is a no sub weapon run, so it's gonna be tough. I told you guys, oh shit, who I'm, who I'm using, right? My racer. Oh shit, man. This is, I'm doing really bad. Oh boy. Really, really bad now. Uh, yeah. Oh, I just passed Usagi Yojimbo. But, you know, my car's red, so obviously I'm Wrath. That's how you indicate it in, in Ninja Turtle F-Zero. That would be awesome, though. Ninja Turtle F-Zero. Ninja Turtle NES F-Zero. Make it, somebody. Or you can just use your imagination, like me, and pretend that we're playing it right now. Because basically, it would just be this game, except <laughs> with the Ninja Turtles in the car. The characters are just driving the cars, so it makes no difference. So li literally, it's the same exact fucking game. It makes no difference. All right, final lap. Oh my god. Oh yeah, all right. Well, there, I just lost that life. Jesus, that was a wreck. Imagine a racetrack that takes place inside the Technodrome. There you go. I want to fucking see that. There's enough characters in Ninja Turtles. I mean, like Vernon or whatever, Ber Burn Thompson's like driving one of these. It replace him with uh, Samurai Goro. <laughs> Burn Thompson. Fucking, uh, I don't know, like Jody is like Irma or some shit. Right. Or April O'Neil. April O'Neil could be the yellow car. Fucking uh, Golden Fox, Megan Fox, eh? Say so, yeah, I'm making connections, huh? The seven degrees of Raphael, something. I don't know what I'm talking about. I feel like I'm going crazy. I am going crazy. It's fine. I'm allowed to do that on my stream. It's my fucking stream. I'll go crazy if I want to, and I'll talk about stupid childless bullshit if I want to. God damn it. Let me live, all right? Fuck. Oh, missed it. Fuck. Oh. It's not over? 
This is nuts. I feel like I'm in a. I don't even. I don't even know how to describe it. It's so fast. That's what I'm trying to say. That's what I'm trying to say. It's very fast. There's no, there's no game with this sense of speed. None. This is the o this is the only game that's as, that's as fast as this. How did they do this? It's a fucking magic. This team, the team that made this fucking made magic happen. I swear to God, in my opinion. Whoa. Boom! Ba -da 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 -da. Is it even possible for him to win? I guess if I like, what would have to happen? As far as uh, other than me like falling off the track and blowing up, um, he'd have to come in first, and I have to come in what like eighth or something. So I have a pretty darn good chance here. I think this is the last one. Yeah, mute city. Oh fuck! How many lives do I have? Is see, actually. Forgot it was gonna be this one. This is oh boy, shit, 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 shit. I, I'm actually pretty worried here because this is uh has all these jumps and shit. Fuck. I actually I, I could actually easily lose this. All right, well wish me luck. Here we go. Hmm. <clears throat> Shit's about to get crazy. It shows it right there. There's Olaf. Motherfucker. Who is that guy? Does that guy have a name in the F Zero universe? Name him. If he doesn't have him, name him Mike Mate. <laughs> that was Mike Mate. Here we go. Three, two. You boost and use that. And I'm like, oh, I was bad. Ah, ah, ah. Yeah! Oh! My hands are sweating so much. My hands are sweating so much. Oh my god. It's disgusting. Like a fucking bathtub just flew out of me. Jesus. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, well that's standard. <laughs> Liquid Schwartz. This game's so fun. Look at that. Beat the cup by 110 points, a strong lead.
Boob Physics says that they could sync uh, my screaming with hentai. Yes, you could. Spend uh, the next 20 years of your life working on that, doing a really uh, qual- high quality uh, lip sync. Animated lip sync. It's a lot, a lot of fun. Have fun with that. It's a pain in the ass doing that. All right, what are we asking them? What was the key to your win? Got a message for your rivals? Oh, I got a message for them. Got a message for your viewers. No, I want a message for my rivals. Let's hear it. Fuck you. Your rivals are howling for revenge. Thank you for the interview. I will fuck them all up. They are mother that's what he said. Fuck, <laughs> fuck, fuck, I'm talking about. Right, fuck, I'm right, I will eat their children. I will eat their children. <laughs> Thanks for playing. All right, guys, that's it for now. This game is too much fun. Um, if you haven't played this game, you. Or you, requ- you are required to play this game. That's what I have to say. Because it's so good. Alright, guys. I have to go. Uh, have a good one. Thanks for all the subs. Thanks for all the follows. All that good stuff. Hope you enjoy the stream. And we'll be back for more. If you missed it, yesterday I beat Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles with Raphael only. Go check that out on YouTube or the VOD is here on Twitch. Thanks. Oh, I just got a raid. Really? Big raid, too. All right. He did that on purpose, didn't he? All right. Well, I was about to leave, but with a with a raid that big, I guess I can't leave just yet, can I? All right. I guess we're playing one more. <clears throat> I'll stick around. You got me. You got me. That's for for Cody. I'll do this. So uh, DS Koopa just raided. Thank you very much, DS Koopa. I was 30 seconds from getting off. But uh, you you got me. So uh, I've been playing F-Zero uh, GX here. I've been having a lot of fun with it. Um, so, geez, I don't know. I, I'll do I'll do the one that I haven't done, I guess. Um, let's start from there. Uh, it's Emerald. I'll do Emerald Cup. I, I was about to leave, but... Um, that guilt raid. Yeah, it's a guilt raid. All right. I'll, I'll do one more, uh, whatever, cup. We'll do Emerald Cup once. Let's take a look at it before I go. Let's stick around a little bit longer. Uh, so to you guys that are joining from uh, DS Koopa's stream, I was about to stop. I just went through um, Standard Cup. Um, and... This game's a lot of fun. I, like, really, really like this game. Like, what I can say is that if you haven't played this game, you should, because if you ever wanted to experience speed in a game and, like, you want a fast-paced, fun game, this is the game for you. Now, now this is a super famous game, by the way, so it's not like... But, I mean, it's older now. I mean, this game came out long time ago so if you don't I guess if you don't have a GameCube or if you don't have a Wii uh, you're probably not playing this game unless uh, I mean I guess you could do an emulator right uh, I was told earlier which I didn't even realize I uh, oh no, no 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 we were talking about the arcade version you can there's another one called uh, F-Zero AX I think uh, for the arcade and uh, that one I was talking about playing in an emulator but I guess you can also emulate there's a emulator called I think it's called Dolphin, Dolphin Emulator, so you can probably do it like that if you can't get a hold of, you know, uh, a physical copy or whatever, but uh, I am playing on a real GameCube. I'm weird, so I like playing my GameCube games on a GameCube. I know you can play them on a Wii, Um, but... uh, I guess I don't play with my Wii quite as much as other people.
That's what she said. Um, no, I pl I'm playing on GameCube. It's a Spice Orange, Spice Orange GameCube. And I love my GameCube. We were talking about WaveBird controllers earlier. Do they have any uh, WaveBird controllers over at Pink Gorilla? That's what I want to know. Somebody asked Cody to send me some WaveBird controllers. No, not really. I'm just... I bet they do. He's got all kinds of stuff over there. There's actually a PC Engine thing he has that I want. <laughs> and I just remembered. I, I was doing a... Uh, he was doing a stream one day. I was watching. He's got... I can't remember what the hell it was, but it's something I want for PC Engine. Anyway. Um... So yeah, yeah. If, if, uh, you guys that are from my stream, if you haven't ever watched his stream, so he has a game store, and uh, he like fixes consoles, and he'll talk about games and stuff like that. So it's uh, I don't think I don't know if he plays games on stream. He more just like uh, it's more like a managing a game store kind of thing. It's, it's it's totally different than what I do, but it's really cool. But it's related to gaming, so check him out. Orange is your porn name. I would have figured it was Al Brontosaurus, but okay. I guess that's your Twitch name. All the content from AX Arcade version of the game is playable at Maps Zero GX if you unlock it. But really now? I knew that if you did the like master levels or whatever, I knew I knew you could unlock like higher levels, but I didn't know it was the I didn't realize it was the content from the arcade. That's worth working for, then. Um, I thought I was working towards unlocking master levels. I didn't know. I was, the ultimate goal of the game is to unlock the arcade game. Oh! I didn't realize that. I thought it was to unlock the, like the, the, high, the hard levels. Beating everything on master gets you the AX content. Oh, fuck. Okay, well then, I have to do this on Master then, for sure. Shit. Now now I understand, okay? Thank you, uh, Davey Hux, for the Tier 1 sub. Appreciate that. Mike likes his spice. I do. I love my spice orange GameCube. Pink Gorilla, that's Kelsey's store. Yes, it's Kelsey. Gravity Gunner on a wave bar. Dibs on a wave bar controller. So I'm in first so far. Big Fang is who I have to worry about. Oh, wait, no, 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 wait, wait, wait. It's, is it? Yeah, Big Fang is who I'm worried about so far. Okay, now I know. Thank you, Charger Charlie, for the sub. Love this game, and thanks for staying on a little longer. Yeah, I mean, I've been playing for three hours now, so it's, you know, after, the, after this one, I'm going to stop. But, um... I'm going to come back to this game, don't worry. If you like F-Zero GX, don't worry, I'm not done at all. We're going to be playing this for a while now. I was, I was playing a lot of Ninja Turtles, now we're going to be doing this for a little while. So glad I decided to come back to this game because, like I said, I own this game when it came out, and I, I played a good deal of it back then. I never did like the master stuff back then, but I at least um, I did more than I've done, with, you know, so far. What we're doing here, um, I made it further than this. But uh, my goal is to—I'd love to unlock all that arcade stuff. We'll see how hard it is, but that would be fucking awesome. I really want to. I wonder how it looks on GameCube compared to like arcade. 
actually, like if you play, you know, as far as like the graphics go. Have to like, fuck. Have to like look into that. Damn it. It's fucking all gone off the rails there. The graphics are the same between GameCube and Arcade, is it? Similar? Well, that's good to know then. Then I, that, then I really want to do it. Shit. Yeah, I definitely never did that before. I was talking about uh, Monkey Ball earlier because it's the same team that developed it. Monkey Ball, I did everything in Monkey Ball One and Two. That, that I did. Uh, all of it, all the master stuff. It, you know, I got super into that. This game, I did not. But that's good because that leaves a, you know, a good challenge for me to to do that. It'll be my first time if I uh, unlock all the. You know, if I unlock the arcade stuff, that will be my first time doing that. But I would like to go back one day and do all that monkey ball stuff. Love that. Love those games. So a lot of GameCube to be had here. Think about my other favorite GameCube games. I loved Wind Waker. Um, at least when it came out. Um, GameCube stuff. Uh, Smash Brothers Melee. I mean, the obvious stuff, I guess. But uh, James Bond Nightfire. I play a lot of. game I played a good deal of Gauntlet Dark Legacy is it? I played the N64 one of that too. Gauntlet game. Um, trying to think. I'm drawing I'm drawing a big blank in my mind right now. I'm, I'm also trying to do this right now so I'm like trying to focus. Oh my god, that was like real life. Oh my god. I felt like that actually happened to me. Oh, that was horrifying. Oh my god, I'm gonna be traumatized. Oh my god. Just smack into the fucking tree. We're off a ramp. Oh my god, it was awful. Awful. Oh Jesus. It, it, the game has such speed that when you crash, it really is just. It really affects you. Here, this is like, I gotta slow down there. That's the part you gotta be careful. All right, at least I know now what part to be really careful. I'll, I'll do it. I think. I just gotta slow down there a bit. Now, I usually don't rate games 
I don't like to rate games, really. Um, but I'm going to throw out a rating for this game. Um, my rating for this game is 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. No joke. It's only certain games I will give that rating. Out of all the games that I don't rate, because I don't rate games very much. Does that make any sense? Am I making any sense here? Well, if I don't rate many games and uh, rate this one a 10, Pac-Man, that's another 10 right there. <laughs> no, but really, uh, this game is fucking amazing, is all I'm trying to say. This and Pac-Man. <laughs> Fuck. I do, uh, I'm not shitting on Pac-Man, you guys know that I like Pac-Man. like me some Pac-Man. And there you go. First place. Good, good, good. doing BS Zelda, Chains of Mike Mondays. Oh, the Stone Tap. Yeah, it's like a different one, right? Uh, I mean, maybe eventually. Some, maybe someday, I don't know. Possibly. That's more likely for maybe a stream or something. You gotta know He-Man before you know Pac-Man. Oh man, it's gotta be He-Man. Oh, the Link to the Past version of it. Okay. All oh, right, I played that before. All right, how many more? Two more? Three more, okay. I don't know if I'm gonna make it. Oh, the casino. on this one or what? Oh, that's the first lap? Jesus fucking Christ. It goes on forever. Just take the entire time and try to fucking kill the rival. If he ever fucking comes back. Where are you? Come on. There he is. What the fuck is, was that? I 
I don't know. I might have gotten. I might have got the rival. Oh no, there he is. He's fucking ahead of me. Fuck you! Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, thank God, thank God. Alright. Jesus. Did I get him? That time I might have got him. Now we're out of here. I might have got him. I think I did. If I did, then I probably fucking won this shit. That's a big deal. I'm trying to look. I can't look at the chat. They probably know if I did it. Because I think I saw Skull come up there. Hopefully. Because if I took out the rival there, then I'll get fucking nothing. And then I'll be like, you know, ahead with score. Placement, whatever you want to call it. Oh no! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Holy crap. <laughs> Thought I was gonna die. Does anybody see if I got him? Sweet air. Definitely got him, says Brisby. Okay, thanks, Brisby. All right, so let's see. Yeah, look, I'm more than 100 points ahead. So I'm pretty, let's, you know, I don't want to get cocky about it, but pretty good shape. Look at this guy driving his little car. Locked on, man. So F0 GX over F0 Super Nintendo. Um, I love F0 and Super Nintendo. It's almost like, that's so nostalgic, but um, yeah, I think I, I, I think I do uh, like this one better. But I mean, I, I love that game too though. So, um, yeah, but it's, it's two different things. But yeah, I think this is more fun. This might stop me. I probably I might not make this, and I'll have to like pick it up tomorrow or something. I'll take a break. I remember this course though. Pretty sure you can go flying off the edges and shit. Be real careful. Like that kind of you know, almost fucking just did right there. And again, Jesus, this is really gonna be dangerous. Yeah, called it, called it. I'm probably gonna have to do this one. I remember hating this course, I think. Shit, three lives. One. Just 
driving down the track is dangerous on this. That's what I remember about this course. Damn it. It's it's like it takes a long time to fucking goddamn fucking course. It's not even like so much about like even winning like first place in this one, it's more like just making it because it's so fucking like it's so easy to fly off the fucking horse. Fucking uh, Star Fox. To fucking. I need to be able to fly in a fucking plane to get by this fucking level. This plane needs some fucking wings. Or this car needs some wings. 
probably gonna end up having to do this uh, course tomorrow. Don't get fancy on this shit. Don't get fancy, there's no need. Let's see if I make it, I don't know. I have a feeling this course might get me. Like, I didn't, I didn't even fucking know it was gonna happen there. It was my last one. That's life. To not only do this, but to do the fucking next one, too. flying off the fucking track. Alright, I'll try I'll try this again tomorrow. Uh, regardless, this the game's awesome. Uh, I'll have to put more time into this track. It's crazy, you keep flying off. <sighs> yeah, it's a tough game. Alright guys, I'm gonna stop for now. Get, this game's awesome. You gotta try it out if you haven't played it. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Fun stream. See you later guys. Bye. I am streaming live and this is F-Zero GX for the Nintendo GameCube. Um, so I've been playing this the last few days. Uh, as you can see, I'm getting the stars here. The stars are for the difficulty. And basically, uh, I'm going through the different cups and I'm going through the story mode and all that good stuff. So. That's so what we're doing. We're just playing some F-Zero GX. So, uh, I had already run, run through the Ruby Cup a bit. Sapphire Cup, I did, uh, guess what, like easy, medium, and expert on Ruby. I did easy, standard on Sapphire, and I haven't really done the Emerald. So we're gonna do the Emerald now on the easy, and we're gonna start there. What's up, Prince of All Jobbers? Thanks for coming in. This is Emerald Cup. Firefield, which was the last stage in the Super Nintendo game, I believe. Kind of cool that they throw that in here. A lot of throwbacks to the Super Nintendo game, I like that. They have like big blue and whatnot. What's up, EMS? All right, here we go. When you cross the finish line, it's the first time you get your uh, boost power. Okay, I got that one. That one. That one. It's kind of like I'm following them because they, they seem to know where the boosts are on this. Oh shit, they got that one. Oh fuck! All right, well that, that's that. Oh no, I can't do retry. I have to, cause that's gonna shit. I went flying off the fucking thing. I'm gonna have to completely reset it. All right, I'm doing Emerald Cup. 
God damn it. What's up, Epcot, Epcot Pizza? Thanks for coming in. Batman is in this game. Um, all the characters are Batman. What are you talking about? Spamming the chat. That's always good. <laughs> always the rival. Rocking the wave bird. I'm not. Um, I just have the like clear controller in. fire field in first place. I might even take second. Whatever, let's just get through it. Somebody was asking me if I like it better than the Super Nintendo game. I think I do. Believe it or not. Did I? T oh, I took him out and he was first. Oh, that's good news. That is fucking good news. Right there. I can take him out. Holy crap. Oh my god, I'm all over the place. Seriously? All right. Guess we're trying this again. Fuck me. G going around this like pipe thing is rough. Now this is pod racing. Mike, what time do you go to bed? Asks Rare Pinball. I have no bedtime. <laughs> I go to bed whenever and wake up whenever. Thank you, Chris Mac82. You never beat F Zero GX so tough. Yes, Outlaws Generation. Well, that's what I'm working on. It is tough. Hopefully, I'll get through it. Emerald Cup is real tough. So apparently, though, um, if I make it further uh, through the Master Cups, because I guess it's. I guess it's a uh, novice, standard, expert, I guess it's master, and I, if I beat all of those, then it unlocks the arcade game, apparently, so I'm excited about that, if I can ever get there. It might take me forever, though. Creep Fighter says maneuvering the pipe is hard. Let me tell you, if I know one thing, it's, it's all about maneuvering the pipe. Thank you for the raid, Mellow Manny, I appreciate that. Like Bob Saget told me, he had a dream about shaving your balls. Any thoughts? Um, well, I always dream about melting his balls, so I mean, it, that that's fair, right? Thank you, Outlaws. Hey, XU, honey. 
So this first Firefield is rough. I remember in the Super Nintendo game, Firefield was always, I think, the hardest stage as well. I mean, completely different level design, but good old Firefield. And that sucks too, because I killed the first place guy before, so. There it is. Did I get it? No, I did not get it. Great. The whole stream is going to be me trying to beat this one level. There we go. I've got that at least. Oh my god. There we go. Alright. That's step one. time being until I go flying off the fucking edge of this thing. Holy crap. Holy crap. Good. Let's see the next one. Good. Good, good, good. Got that. And this is where I get nervous. Get him? I got him. Maybe I'll actually get it this time. I got two. I killed two guys. <sighs> shit, shit, shit. What's this next thing? Oh my god. I'm all over the place. Not good. I fucked that up. This fucking rock and roll. That. That. Oh. I am in trouble. Oh no! Come on! That was the fucking end. I would have won. I got first. Would have got first place. That's the hardest fucking part. Is knowing. God, I was like on the top half of it. I gotta figure out how to know. Fucking shit. That's the part I can't get, is like what side to be on. They need a giant flag to be like this side up. Damn it. Thank you, Chris Mac82, for the sub. This is what happens when you build a racetrack in the surface of a star. <laughs> Too much gray says Mike's day job is selling hot dogs in downtown New Jersey. His most famous dog is called the Throat Buster. That's right. Um, and I'm sure you, you've had had my Throat Buster quite a few times, have you not? It, it's, isn't it not delicious? This game looks good even by today's standards. It's just, it's amazing. somebody asking about a room tour so um, I've done room tours game collections all, all that kind of stuff the last one of those type of things that I did was I did a sort of um, console collection video um, which isn't exactly a room tour but um, 
that was the last type of those videos that I did, and uh, I showed I showed a bunch of my consoles. I didn't really talk about like NES and like you know Genesis and stuff because it's like everybody's heard about that. You know, it's not like super interesting. But I showed off a lot of uh, the more obscure stuff that I have, or some of some of them. Um, I actually at some point probably do some kind of update to that uh occasionally i'll do videos on my patreon i have patreon um actually i just did a uh q a thing on my patreon where people on my patreon would ask me questions and then uh i did a video response uh so that's the last thing i did on patreon but i also do like other stuff on there where you know talking about different consoles and you know marquees and all kinds of controllers all kinds of stuff so um, a lot of times I'll do stuff like that on there first and then at some point later have that come to YouTube so alright so that was flap one But that's fun. I don't know if any of those guys happen to be in here now, but if, if you're somebody that uh, was, did ask me any of those questions and I answered on Patreon, you know, thanks for supporting me on there, on Patreon, and, uh, you know, thanks for the questions. Everybody asked for really good questions, so, you know, thanks for that. And if you like that kind of thing, I'll, I'll, I'll do that again on there at some point. All right, so go through the three things, I guess. I'll, I'll aim for the three, the three things when I do this. I killed two guys, apparently. I don't know. Okay. Okay, there's one. There's two. Let's see the third. Ah! Didn't quite make that one. Alright, I'm gonna use a boost there. Because I missed that one. Okay, there's three things here. It's like these, maybe? Oh god. Yes, go, 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 use it all. All right. I could have definitely used more uh, boost earlier, but I was trying to be careful. There we go, so finally we got through first place on that. All right, so uh, just so you know what I've done so far, I did Ruby Cup, Novice, Standard, and Expert. I did em uh, the Emerald Cup, no, I'm doing Emerald Cup. The Sapphire Cup I did, I did Novice and Standard. I haven't done Expert on that yet. And then right now, this is novice for this. this is a, oh, it's getting harder. Yeah, John Foster. Yes, there you go. Uh, I answered your question. I'm glad you watched that. And uh, yeah, I did. I did do that. I took that for you, actually. So thanks for being there. Thank you, Brundlefly. Thanks for coming in, uh, Live Fly 101. Trying to unlock the F Zero AX arcade mode. I am, uh, Emil Sand. Do, have you done that before? Has Has anybody actually that's in here done the F Zero? Uh, have any of you guys that are in here now unlocked the arcade in this? Um, because what I, I think you have to do. Tell me if I'm wrong, please, because I, I need to know. Uh, I think you have to unlock all this on Master, and I've done none of that so far. The most I've done so far is the Ruby Expert, so it's going to take a while.
Kelsius unlocked AX. Do you remember how you did it? Is it like be by beating the master levels? Tech Funk said it's only cheat codes, but you can get tracks from AX, but not the arcade game. I thought the arcade game is AX, though. Isn't it called F Zero AX? Thank you, X Fubar. AX was a separate game entirely? Well, what's the arcade game called then? Hang on, let me look this up. F Zero AX Arcade Machine. Well, now I'm definitely confused. I'm looking it up and it says F Zero AX. I thought it was called F Zero AX. Hang on a second. Yeah, you know what? I'm looking at a cockpit picture of it and it says F Zero AX. That's what I thought. So I don't know what you're talking about. I'm just confused. I read F0 AX is hidden in F0 GX. An action replay cheat code unlocks it. Oh, so you're saying using a cheat code can unlock it. Yeah, but I don't I don't want to do that. I want to do it like the legit way, which I believe is to beat it all on master. That's what I'm trying to do here. At least that's what I was told you're supposed to do. I'm just kind of trying to confirm that that's what you that that's what you do. I, th I think that's what you do. You unlock tracks on Master, not the game. Oh, oh, okay. So you don't unlock like the full game, but you un do you just do you know do you do you unlock just like a couple tracks from it, or do you like you don't unlock the like the entire game? You can't. You unlock it by winning expert slash master class Grand Prix. Right, which is what I thought. I'm not sure if it's a star requirement. But after completing every difficult every difficulty up to expert master unlocks it. Okay, so I pro so I have to do everything on expert and then maybe the master mode like gets unlocked or something. Beat all the cups on master difficulty and AX tracks from the arcade game will become available for purchase. Okay, so then it's like I gotta buy it with tickets from like doing the doing the regular tracks, I guess, or something. Interesting. Buy them all to unlock the fifth and final cup, AX cup. If you beat the latter, you'll unlock AX Mute City. Sonic Oval track, this 26 and last track. Okay, so you also get something for unlocking the if if you beat the AX Cup, once that's unlocked, then you get then you get one additional track. That's cool too. I didn't know about that. So that's like the final final thing. Wow. So there's there's like a lot to do here. Alright, so Sorry, I just wanted to understand that. I was talking to the chat a bit just to, you know, kind of confirm what the hell we're doing here. So, okay, I have more of an idea. So basically keep playing and um, beat everything that's really hard. <laughs> it's gonna take me forever to do this, but I'm enjoying it, so whatever. All right, so Green Plant. Now, this is like not a Super Nintendo level. Like the first one was. This is, I guess, th I guess this is a course that's just from this game, I suppose. It's funny that it's like a little like Mario Kart 8 where it's like they have like the old tracks from the old games, you know, but sort of redesigned. They kind of do the same thing here. Last time you're going to say you do more Dungeon Warfare. I do want to do more Dungeon Warfare. I, 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 I probably will be do, I probably will do that. Actually, I, I like that game a lot. Um, I was playing it. Um, I, I play it a little bit on my iPad as well. Um, so, um, I was trying it on that, which I, I don't like it quite as much on the iPad, um, because the controls aren't as good. If you're going to get Dungeon Warp Warfare, 
get it if you have a PC, play it on PC because it's, it's a lot. It's better with the keyboard and mouse. But honestly, like, I mean, I haven't beaten it yet, and I, I want to. But um, I think Dungeon Warfare might be like the best tower defense game that I played. Uh, honestly, it doesn't have some of the stupid shit that is in some of the other ones that I play that like annoy me. Um, but I'm talking about the PC, like Steam version of it. Um, the on the iPad, like the controls get a little like the way you have to like click things and like you'll have to like. For example, I'll give you one example. Like if you're playing it on the iPad, like oh fuck, I just said that. God damn it. Uh, if you're playing it on the iPad. That fucking sucks that that just happened. Um, you have to drop these little traps, and you have to like hold your finger down on the screen, and a lot of times it like doesn't like fucking like work well. It doesn't like register it, and it makes it like it's just shitty. It's like the kind of you just want to use a fucking mouse. It's you know, it just doesn't work as well. And I think the game is also on Switch, so I haven't played that version of it. But if that's also like. Anything like the you know playing it on an iPad, then it's it's probably you probably want to just to get it on PC, you know. So when I'm when I'm recommending that game, you should understand that I'm recommending the PC version of it, not so much the other ones. But anyway. Now I know that part is he can go flying right off. Oh my god. I didn't realize my energy was so fucking low. That was a little better than this. God. Oh, thank God, thank God. Good, 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 good. And right, oh, what's after this? The dangerous part. Right here, so I'm like pulling back a little bit. Yeah, you just gotta be careful right there. Nice, all right, all right, that's two down. Thank you, XFUBAR. You also unlock Diamond Cup if you win keep winning in different difficulties. Do, is Diamond Cup after Emerald? So wait, so there's four cups to do before you... Do you have to do four cups? Then? And then after that, if you do the master of that, then it's unlocks the AX shit. So I didn't realize about the Diamond. Because I haven't gotten to that yet. Hey, Mike just found out someone made a ROM hack of Monkey Ball 2 with custom tracks. But you have to do it on an emulator dolphin. Okay, that's fine. I don't mind using an emulator. Especially, you know, for something like that where you have to. It's awesome, uh, John Retro King. Is this game expensive? Uh, I don't know. Uh, what does this game go for uh, these days? Where's the box? Uh, I don't know, I have, I have the box sitting around somewhere. Whatever, I don't know where I put it. What's better racing game, F-Zero or Mario Kart? I don't know, they're both different. You, you want to play them both because they're both great, so. I don't need, why, if you're gonna play both of them, why bother asking what's better? Just play both of them. You get a new star every time you win a cup in a different difficulty. Once you get enough, you unlock diamond and then AX. Okay, so diamond is first, okay. Thanks, Hypernova. TMNT when? I did, I did TMNT. I don't think, I don't think there's anything left for me to do, really. Uh, or not much. 
Uh, I mean, I could do like Leonardo or something. I don't know. I'm pretty much done with that. I don't know. I don't know how much I care anymore. It's like, I think that's a bit. I think that's about it for me in that game. I mean, I'm sure there's a little bit more. I could probably find. I could probably find something to do in it. You know. But I don't know. I, I'm feeling pretty done with TMNT on NES. I think. I think I'm good on that. At least for the time being. Maybe at some point. I'll get in the mood to do something else with it. I don't know, but I don't know. I, I think that's about it. <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm pretty satisfied. Time to time to move on. There's so many video games out there. It's like, you know, I'm I'm into this right now. I want to unlock this shit on uh, everything. I don't know if I can do it, but I want to try. Boost. Do, 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 do. There's also story mode, which I've been going back and forth between the cups and the, and the story mode. So we've been doing a little bit of that too. So there's just a lot to this game. It's crazy. It's a really good game. Really, really good game. I don't want to use up too much life, so. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! I knew I shouldn't have hit that. Fuck me. What about Manhattan Project? Turtles in Time, Arcade, or Hyper Stone Heist? Well, uh, I've done Turtles in Time, I've done the Arcade. Manhattan Project, I haven't streamed yet, I don't think. Hyper Stone Heist, uh, you might see something coming soon for that, actually. Story mode in very hard is just crazy. Do you have to do the story mode shit also in order to unlock like diamond and AX, or is that just about like the regular cups? All right, I got to retry this. I don't know if like the story and like regular cups are related at all. Like what? Actually, there's a the question. What do you get if you beat everything in story? You don't, do you unlock everything if you do that? Or is that just like a cutscene or something? Unlock anything, as in like unlock any tracks or anything, I don't know. I guess it would make sense that most of the stuff you unlock is in the regular, like, cups. If you beat story, it should unlock like this fucking Super Nintendo game. I'm sure I, I know that's that's not in there, but I could have done something like that maybe. I don't know if they ever did anything like that on Super on GameCube, where like you unlock an old like NES or SNES game or something like that. I feel like what was I playing that? Oh, you know what unlocks uh, an NES? If you do um, one of the Xbox Ninja Gaiden's unlocks the old uh, NES games. A lot of times when they do that kind of shit, like, it's never, like, very good. I remember I was playing uh, Contra 4 on DS, and you could unlock, I think, the original Contra, and I did, and it fucking sucked. Like, it's a shitty-ass, like, ROM of it. I think, I think that's what it was. At least from memory. 
but a lot of times that happens. It's like you get to unlock the original game. You know what's another example, actually? I'll give you an even better example. Doom Eternal, where you unlock, like, Doom 2 or whatever, and it, it fucking, it's like a shit version of the, like, you don't want to play the original Doom games on... Like, they, they, they make it to where it's, like, not even fucking playable. It's, like, this trash fucking version of the fucking game where you're, like, this sucks, you know? You unlock it, but it's, like, you know. And what if, like, Doom Eternal is, like, your first time playing Doom, let's say, and then you unlock it, and you're, like, oh, I'll try the original games out, and then you're, like, oh, these games suck. But, but you're going to think that because, you know, if, like, a kid's playing or something, they're going to think that because it's a fucking shitty, like port of it. And I can't believe they did that. Doom Eternal was such a good game. Uh, I really, really, really enjoyed Doom Eternal. But man, the fucking original Doom and Doom 2 that they put on there fucking sucked. It's like unplayable. You know? The, that was unfortunate. They, need to, they definitely should go in and fix that, because that's like, that's bullshitty. You collect all those, like, whatever, cards or whatever it is that you collect in the game, and then you go finally go to play it, and it's like, oh, this is not playable. You know, or barely play. I mean, you can play it, but it's just like, you know, it's a sh shitty fucking... They did a bad job with that. Thank you, Ander Westholm, for that tier, for that Twitch Prime sub. If you guys have Amazon Prime, you can sub for free. Thank you, One Up Gaming, for the host. Beating story missions on very hard unlocks you F Zero AX pilots. Ah, pilots for AX. Hmm. So they make everything like kind of worth, you know, doing. Man, you could put in, you can dump a bunch of hours into this game, huh? Psych Bike 64 had the original Psych Bike on it. Jeez, I don't remember that, but um, I don't remember that Excite Bike was NES was on there. But but I do. I, I love that game. I'll have to stream Excite Bike 64 someday because I do. I do love that game, or at least I used to. I haven't played it in a while. What's one of your favorite Star Trek The Next Generation episodes? Asked Rob. Um, I like Best of Both Worlds. Uh, uh, I mean, like, Inner Light. I like um, um, the one with Barkley where he gets hooked up. The, like the What is it? The nth degree or the ninth degree or whatever. Like, that's a really good one. I like... The episode with Worf, uh, I call Parallels, Redemption, I think I, I remember liking a lot, um, Brothers, um, I don't know, there's a, there's a lot of good episodes. Anything with Q is nice. Most of the Q ones, I, I actually really like the last episode, uh, uh, all good things. That I, I like. I think that was a great way to end it. I think I should probably should have just fucking ended right there. Honestly, because it was a good send off. What's my favorite GameCube game? Um, this here is up there, but um, probably the the first thing that popped in my head was Monkey Ball, like Monkey Ball One and Two. I almost consider them like the same fucking game because it's like they're. I put them together, but yeah, Monkey Ball 1 and 2 I love, uh, what else do I really love? Um, 
I mean, I like the Rogue Squadron game on GameCube. Um, I'm trying to think. Thank you, uh, Small Stools, for that sub. Have I streamed Zombies Ate My Neighbors? I think so. If, I think it was a really long time ago, but I'm pretty sure I did. I streamed the second, I streamed the Ghoul Patrol one. Uh, I didn't beat it, but I made it pretty far. I, I like that game, actually. Have I played Papers Boy 64? I have. I got that game uh, as a birthday present when it came out, and I fucking hated it. I absolutely fucking hated it. To the point where I went and I returned the game, which is, back then it was like, I, I, I disliked that game so much, I literally took it back to the store, to KB. It was at KB, and I returned it. It was uh, horrible. Have you already talked about your lack of interest to the new Star Trek spinoff Captain Pike show? It doesn't look good. I have not talked about it, but I saw like news about it. Yeah, I don't care. I'm done. I'm done with Star Trek. I, like there hasn't been good Star Trek since the 90s. Like it's over. I'm done. I'll, I watch other things. If I want to watch Star Trek, I'll go back and watch like you know the original fucking series or Next Gen or Voyager or whatever you know on, on like fucking Netflix or something. It's, I'm, I'm done with that shit. What is your most hated game when you were a kid that you remember? Oh, gee. The first thing that popped in my head was uh, Skate or Die. I fucking hated that. Um, I don't know. There's probably a ton of things. You know? Here we go. Oh, it's this fucking stage. All right, well, this this stage might fuck me. This stage is, like, you just go flying off the edge. I have a very hard time with this level. So we'll see how this goes. I was trying to do this at the end of the last stream. This is uh, this is kind of uh, I don't think I like this track. <laughs> I think this is the only track so far in the game that I'm like, I don't think I like this track. It's too easy to fly off the fucking edge here. I don't know, maybe I'll get better at it, but. Shit, like I don't like that. Like, how are you supposed to handle that? I just want to make it through this, even if I fucking like lose. I, I'll, I'm glad to take like tenth place on this. I don't even care. I just want to make it to the end without fucking flying off. So good. Yeah, that's definitely what I just 
decided. I don't even care about. God. I just want to make it. I can come in 20th place. It's fine. No, don't, don't. Oh, fuck, are you fucking... I'm in, I'm in, I'm in the fucking the recharge! It's the last fucking lap! Fuck this level, I swear to God. What did I fucking hit? The fucking those like poles? Those like fucking neon pole things? I think. What the hell happened? I guess I hit. God only knows. Fuck out of here. last time like it's really saved my energy A very hard course. All right. Difficulty five stars. Great. <laughs> Fuck. All 
Alright, I have, th I have three continues here, so. Three lives, I mean. Alright. Oh my god. Holy shit. What if you can, like, practice stages after you. Like, single stages? Is there a practice, like, practice per stage thing? Oh my god! Holy fuck. It, honestly, like, Jesus, how long is this fucking course? Was that lap one? It was like a fucking five minute course. I'm just like fucking completely stalled here. The fuck, man. The fuck. Not good. I don't know how I stalled so badly there. Ah. Oh. oh, this is not good. Fuck you. Did I get him? No, I didn't. Huh? Fuck. That would have been the whole thing right there. Uh, oh! Shit, this is insane. All right, we filled up the health. This is an awesome course. Gotta not <laughs> blow up. Is your setting and done? There, we go. Mm. there you go. That wasn't so bad, actually. Well, I think, there you go, that was Animal Cup, right? Cool. So it's really just that fourth level that's really horrible. That one's not too bad. Cool. All right, we got through it. Super Nintendo F-Zero is hard enough. This is insane. Super Nintendo F-Zero gets really hard. Yeah, yeah, definitely. I, I love I love the Super Nintendo game. Firefield. Tell us why you became an F-Zero racer? If I won, uh, the next Grand Prix would be held on our planet bus. I see. Thank you for the interview. That's it, everyone. Fuck did he say? See you at the next Grand Prix.
Something about if he won. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we got some tickets. You love the interviews, you can watch them all on YouTube. You just sit all day and just sit and watch all the F Zero GX interviews. <laughs> Alright, so um So where we're at here. Um I still have to do expert on Sapphire Cup. Um, and it, I guess it hasn't unlocked. I don't like. I wonder at what point it's gonna unlock. Probably once I do expert on all of them. I guess at that point maybe it'll unlock Diamond Cup or something. And then maybe if I beat Diamond Cup on expert, maybe it'll unlock the master levels. Then I'm not sure. Like at what point of this will all happen. But all right. So I'm gonna do. Let me make sure that I'm on expert. All right. We're gonna do expert in Sapphire Cup. Shit's gonna get real now. Diamond, can it be unlocked through standard? Okay, so if I complete everything on standard, Nick, uh, 12787, seven, then I get diamond. First route. Or taking first in them. Wait, 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 wait. So really, I should. So really, then, I should do uh, Emerald Cup in Standard right now, because I have the Standard for the other ones. That would unlock Diamond. So let me... Here, I'm going to quit. Let's do Standard in Emerald, then. See, so yeah, then I'll have all Standard, and that should like, maybe unlock something. Apparently, according to the chat here, so... How come I use Deep Claw? I don't know. I just I like unlocked that driver last time, and he was pretty good. So I've just been using him. I, I don't know. I don't really have a good reason. And I, other than that, I was using like Captain Falcon, or yeah, Captain Falcon. I always want to say Blue Falcon. <laughs> I know what. I should, I, should, I should show that lunchbox I have. All right, here we go. So I'm doing the same thing as I just did, but now it's a little bit harder. So. And then after this, apparently, Diamond Cup, Cup will unlock. And then we'll see what that's all about. I'm curious if I unlock Diamond Cup. I'm curious to see the tracks because I want to know if I recognize them. Because I'm curious how far I went with this game back when I played it, you know, 15, 17 years ago, whenever, whenever it came out. 17, 18 years ago. I definitely remember do it, like doing all these. I have a feeling I might not have done the diamonds shit, but maybe I did. I don't know. So we'll, I'll tell you when we you know, get there. When and if we get there, I'll get, I'll get there eventually. <laughs> Oh yeah, this this track is pretty hard too. Actually, this first one, the first one and the fourth one. Oh. This is where I have a hard time being like on the right 
It's just that part at the end. But I know now to like, go through the three things. The three like blue pole things. That's my indicator for not like falling off the track before the you know the health bar thing. Energy bar, whatever they call that thing. Is there a name for that thing? I use the. I, don't know. I just make up fucking you know, terms here. <laughs> whatever the fuck they call it. There you go. Hit it. Hit that. Oof. That. That. And this one's gonna be like around here somewhere. Got it. Ha. Ah. See. That. Then. Oh fuck. I, like, I got lucky uh, on that one. Oh, fuck. I thought there was another... Oh, my God. I thought there was another lap. That's why I wasn't, like, boosting like crazy. Fucking shit. I should probably redo it. I'm gonna keep going. Let's see what happens. I don't feel like redoing it. I totally thought there was another lap. Thank you, Chris160. Does the difficulty change how good the AI is or just how fast they are? I have no idea, but that's a great question. Blue Falcon is in Scoob, I think. Yeah, well, Blue Falcon's son is in Scoob. And then they mention the real Blue Falcon, but it's not the real Blue Falcon, and it's very upsetting. I was saying, I know why they did that. If See, Blue Falcon was competent. He, he was a competent superhero, from what I remember. If Blue Falcon was in the movie, he would solve the entire fucking problem they're having with uh, Dick Dastardly. And then you wouldn't need to have Scooby-Doo even there because Blue Falcon would just be like, oh, I got this. You guys, like, go home. So I, I think I understand why they have it be, like, Blue Falcon's son, but it's like, I don't know. So he's not, he's not actually in the movie. They should just make a Blue Falcon movie and get it over with. The real Dynamite was in it, though. The real Dynamite, guys. The real Dynamite was there. He was there. I saw him. God. All right, last one. God, I almost went off the side. All right, last thing, last thing, last thing. Go, 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 go. Good. I hope this is right. I hope this un unlocks Diamond Cub. 
guess we're gonna find out. Why won't they make a new F-Zero? Because they don't need to after this game. All you need is this game. However, they should release this game on Switch. I think only three people here know who the hell Dino Mutt is. Well, can I tell you? Go on, go on the internet and search out Blue Falcon Dino Mutt. Make your day better. Make your day a better day by learning who the fuck Dino Mutt is. <laughs> Thanks, Autobot. The dog version of Inspector Gadget. Basically, it's a good way to put it. <laughs> I think the, I, Dynamite probably came first, I would, I would, I would think. Probably around the same time. That's what I get for knocking around, knock around the while. This is James's favorite line from uh, Plan 9 from Outer Space. It's like Tor Johnson. <laughs> it's like, knock around the while. <laughs> you can't understand what he's fucking saying at all. <laughs> did that uh, for Spike.com, I believe. We did Ed Woodathon. Wait, we did Badathon, and then we did Ed Woodathon. That was uh, one of the first things that I did for to be able to get paid, <laughs> frankly. It was that Spike shit we used to do. It was like before YouTube had monetization and everything. Long time ago. There we go. All right. I have three lives here to make this. Don't hit the jumps. I don't want to hit those jumps. I just die. when I hit the jumps, I just die. So it's just like not good. All right. That's one. Do, 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 do. It's a cool level. It's like casino. I really like that one. I think it was a story mode one. Uh, but it's like you're racing and, and the levels, the track's kind of like green. Um, I really like that level a lot. I guess that's not in the like regular tracks. I think it's just story mode. It's a really cool like, stage though. That, and it has like a lot of jumps on it. If you guys know what the one I'm talking about, I did it the other day. It's like an early story mode one, I think. It's a cool, fucking awesome track, I think. Like. Most of the track designs in this game are just, like, awesome. The only one I honestly don't like is, I think it's the one after that. The fourth one on the Emerald is the only one. I don't like that one. I'm not, I'm not a fan of that one, but um, most of the most of the tracks are, like, just, like, amazing. Especially a lot of those, like, big blue ones. catch up with me because I'm so good.
Boom. All right. That one's fine. MTFPB, I haven't played very much of it enough to really comment on it, but I played it a very small amount. I'd like to play it more though. When are you finally going to do the Streets of Rage remake on James and Mike Mondays? Uh, I'll probably like three years from now when everybody stops talking about it. That's how uh, I will play it. That's one. I like, I, I played it by the way though, I like it. I, I like the game, it's a good game. Have you not played the new Streets of Rage? I did a video on it. This is the course I don't like. Light, lightning half pipe. I think this is the one I believe. Right? Pretty sure it is. Yeah. This fuck this stage. I think he's talking about the fan made Streets of Rage remake, not Streets of Rage Four. Oh, you are. Sorry. My bad. Then. Wait. There's a fan made one. I don't know about the fan made one. I haven't heard I haven't heard anybody talk about that. I'll I'll look that up later. I thought you meant the Streets of Rage 4. The fan made one. Uh, yeah, no, I don't I don't know anything about that. I'll have to look that up. That's cool. Is that good? I'll I'll, I'll look that up later. Yeah, sorry. I was I thought you meant Streets, the fourth the Streets of Rage thing. track. Oh my god. That's where I can make my comeback, though. I'm getting better at this track. It's just like, that one fucking awful part, you gotta really just slow down, I guess. I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do when I get to, like, fucking master level or whatever, though. <laughs> I'm gonna be fucked. Fuck 
you. Ha ha. Saved it all for the end. Whew. All right. And the next thing, I have a few lives. I'll, I'll make it through this. So good. All right. We might see this diamond cup today. If it's, if it's true that I'm doing the right thing. Did I finish story mode? No, I gotta go back to it. I'm, I, I forget how far I am. I'm several things into it. It's way better than four. Okay, so it's okay, so it's worth checking out then. way better than the fourth one okay i'll definitely have to check that out is it just it's just called like streets of rage remake is that what it's called i'll, I'll look it up okay i think this is probably the most difficult racing game i ever played story mode especially is nuts says link lineback Okay. The remake makes Streets of Rage 4 look like amateur hour. Okay. All right, well, thanks for letting me know about it. I'll, I'll look into it. Yeah, SH Mario, that's what I'm trying to do, actually. I'm hoping I can get to that. All right, here we go. <clears throat> It's gonna take me time though. Got him too. Got him. Ha. Uh, fuckers. Fuck with me. It's fun to do. I just, the thing is, I don't know the tracks well enough to be confident about where to use the boosts. That's gonna come with like time, you know? If I play the game a ton. Like here you don't wanna go too fast because you gotta like fucking make these turns. That he's on here. Alright. Maybe here, I don't know. Oh, oh! Thank god I hit that. Probably here. Oh fuck, how much, what did I do here? Oh, I shouldn't have done that. That's all right, I have other lives. Ooh. Oh my God. Oh my God, thank you God, thank you God. Thank you God. Turn in. Turn 
again. All right, hit it. Hit it. Fourth place. Got that. Bam. Pop one more burst. And bam! Fuck you. That's a really fun course. I like that a lot better than the, that lightning, whatever one. All right, so we're gonna find out if this is true, if I unlock diamond or not. I hope so, I hope so. And if I didn't, then we gotta figure out what, what I do have to do, so we'll, we'll see in a second. I wonder if you could knock every racer off the track by the end of the race. If you're good enough, I can't do that shit, but it's fun, it's, it's fun to knock the racers like that. CMC says, if I streamed in Twitch, I'd have to change the game every 20 minutes, ha ha. Well, I do that a lot too, like a lot of times on the Ever, that's why I do EverDrive streams where I can get through games like quickly. So sometimes, sometimes I'm just like, I just wanna play like a bunch of games, but like, you know, it depends on the game. Like I have to really like be, you know, like a game, I guess. All right, got a message for the viewers. What's the key to the win? What was the key to your victory? I have more hearts. I see. Thank you for the. That's pretty funny. That's it. What's the key to your victory? I have more arms. <laughs> That's actually pretty funny. <laughs> I like that. Thanks for playing. Stupid, but. Congratulations. Twenty-four tickets. master right and then I have to unlock then I have to be all a master or something and then it unlocks AX we just got to diamond cup so we're gonna be trying that out a minute and I'm curious to see if I've ever seen these courses before we're, we're gonna find out play the final cup of this on earth is it what's up blasto do I did I know about hyper neo geo 64 no what's that hyper ne I'm that's so interesting that I'm gonna look it up hyper neo geo 64 hyper Hyper Neo Geo 64. It looks like arcade. It's an arcade system. Oh, it can do 3D. So basically, it, it did 3D on the Neo Geo. That's interesting. I did not know about that. How many pilots? Did I unlock now? Um, I haven't really been unlocking pilots yet. Uh, we'll, we'll come back and we'll look at that pilots and all that later. Um, I just been basically just using the same guy most most of the time, but 
I, you know what? Really quick, I guess we could do that, and then I'll do diamond. Um, let's just look at that. There was something I wanted to unlock. Um, so there's the shop over here. Machine items. Is it under machine? I think it is. Yeah, all these guys. Um, yeah, Iron Eye, Deep Claw, Green Star. Mighty Typhoon. Somebody was saying Mighty Typhoon is good. Maybe I should buy that. I have a hundred fucking tickets. Astro Robin's pretty good. Astro Robin, where is Astro Robin? Oh, right here. Okay. Astro Robin, I heard Mighty Typhoon's good. Um, I mean, I could get the... I could get those. I'll get Astro Robin, and I'll get, I'm gonna get my ty Typhoon. Mighty Hurricane? That's this guy. I don't wanna waste all my tickets, though. I'll come back to more guys later. I don't wanna get too many. And then down here, do I have more, like, story shit? This I can buy, the Grand Prix, I'll buy that. See now, I only have 40 tickets left. That's all I'm gonna do for now. Can we get a turbo graphic stream sometime? Um, I've done a bunch of turbo graphic streams actually. Uh, I don't know if there's any mods in here now. We could like link, put a link in there or something. Or just check out my channel. What's up, Pizza Gamer? You know, the bigger problem with that CMC is I don't really like that game, so it's like I need the motivation to do it, you know? Like, I like this game. <laughs> All right. Uh, all right, we're gonna do, I guess we'll just start on the basic on this. Alright, let's see if I've seen these courses before. Should I try one of these other guys, too? I don't know. Fuck. Fuck it. I'm gonna try I'm gonna try this guy. Somebody in the chat recommended Astro Robin. I'm gonna try Astro Robin. Alright, this is Diamond Cup. Let's see if we've seen this. You tried to revisit Punch Out, you can't beat Tyson. Tyson's tough. Alright, I have not used this guy, so this is just, I'm going to try it, and we'll see. Uh, let's see, I'll do this race, we'll see if I can, I'm really curious if I've seen this before. I'm just gonna, whatever, I'm gonna keep going. I think I do remember this level. So there's no borders on this. Crazy shit. Oh my god. Yeah, like that. There you go. That's kind of cool. You can do that. Sort of flip the uh, tracks. Dangerous. This racer seems not too bad either, honestly. I'm not too upset with this guy, I guess. I don't know. He's, I feel like he's not going as fast. Oh my god. Look at this. Look at this. Holy shit. Oh my god. Yeah, right. <laughs> uh, 
for some reason you got you were never able able to eat ball beat ball bowl. Ball bowl, uh, yeah, you have to be able to do the timing um, to hit like a stomach. I think you fight him twice, and or that's a timing based thing. So it's a, it's a it's a hard game. Um, I remember last time I was playing that game with James, he was saying that's where he gets stuck too. I think. And then we, then we were playing it, and then but he beat it. it. Like he didn't have a problem. Like he just did it. So, so I don't know. Maybe he, he was having an on on day. But yeah, he 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 had told me that too. That uh, he would get to ball bowl and get stuck there. I guess a lot of people probably do, which which that makes sense. Because uh, if you can't do that timing when he kind of charges you, then it's. It's it's hard. I, I I miss it too sometimes. But I more have trouble like like later once you get to um like Sandman um and like the last few guys and it just it's just a game that just takes a lot of fucking practice. It's a great fucking game. That's one of my favorite NES games. I've streamed a bunch of that though. Like, if you guys want to see my Tyson streams, you can go back and look at those. Um, I've, I've done that before. Plenty. Great, great game though. Definitely one of my favorites. Oh, really? Boom. Boom. There you go. Jesus. I just keep fucking flying off the edge here. That's the hard, <clears throat> hard thing here. It's just. Excuse me, staying on track. Let me just reset this whole thing. Tough track. I'm gonna I'm gonna go back to the guy I was using. Probably a little more comfortable with him. Thank you, Vicarious, Vicarious, for gifting subs out to Luke Star and Special K. Was F Zero in, ever in the arcade? Says Shakedown. So the main thing I'm trying to do here is you can play the arcade tracks in this game if you beat like the whole game on like master so that's what, like what i'm trying to ultimately do here but yeah it was in the arcade it was a huge like cockpit machine yeah so absolutely oh my god i just got lucky Alright, so I, I need to not be like knocking these motherfuckers off. I need to just like get in front of them and stay in front of them, I think. And not be trying to do that. Because I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go flying off the fucking side if I start doing that shit. It's so tempting to do that. I want to do it so bad. This fucking guy. I want to bash him so bad, but I don't want to go off the side, so I'm not gonna do it. That's the hard thing, is resisting the fucking temptation. Alright, this is still lap one. Alright, here we go. That's the end of lap one. We got boost power. Do -do 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 -do. That's a fi what, fire sting, right? That's Samurai Goro there. Fuck him. Fuck him. It's Captain Falcon in the front.
split second. Mm. No, this is the beginning, so I should fucking reset the whole thing. I need to do it like on the first try. God damn it! It is Gum Jumper 22. I just passed this um, a second ago. Like the pink and turquoise guy looked like it's a Pokemon that looks like that, uh, like a po polygon guy. What's that fucking polygon dude's name from Pokemon? I swear to God, there's a car that looks like that. Not Poliwhirl, by the way. If anybody knows his name? Por Porygon? Yeah, that guy. Porygon. There's a car that looks like that. If I see him again, I'll shout him out. side ones do, I don't want to know. One of these days I should stream that Dreamcast PlayStation, uh, it's on both of them, the um, Mickey Mouse Magical Racing. Anybody here? <laughs> There's like a fucking Disney like, racing game. Played it a long time ago. Driving around, I was like Chippin' Dale and shit. It's crazy shit. Speaking of racing games, speaking of fantastic racing games, nobody's talking about Mickey Mouse and Magical Racing. What the fuck is wrong with everyone? Meanwhile, I'm like sitting here playing like fucking F Zero GX. <laughs> Just don't fuck this up. Good. Those tracks go on forever. Like, that track's a little too long. Goes on too fucking long. Beetle Adventure Racing. Yeah. There's another one.
Porygon 2 is more powerful than Porygon 1 and Z. Okay. Well, you, you know, you tell me. <laughs> you know more than me. You already got comfy with the octopus pilot, huh? I kind of, yeah, I don't know. Right now he's my guy. I might, I'll, I might change it up originally, uh, eventually, but I don't know. Have you, you played Slackaholic? You played that game, Magical Racing? He's good, he's weird, but he's good, yeah. What was the cockpit style arcade game where you choose a battle vehicle and you're roaming around in a desert looking place trying to kill opponent vehicles? It had 3D graphics and it came out in the mid 90s. I don't know. So maybe somebody in the chat can answer that. The cockpit game I know is uh, Star Wars. <laughs> that's the one I would. The co that's the cockpit thing that comes to my head or whatever. And I also like that Star Wars battle pod. I think that's fucking fun. All right. Sand Ocean. It's another. Oh, this I, this is gonna kind of resemble the fucking Super Nintendo one, huh? That's funny. Like the way the track is. That's cool. See, this one I don't remember quite yet. I wonder if I never beat that one I just did back when I had this game originally, because this one, I don't think I remember playing this one. I wonder, I bet you I never went through the entire Diamond Cup. I think I unlocked it, probably did the first track, and was like, I mean, I probably couldn't beat it back then, you know, 18 years ago, or I gave up or whatever. I don't think I remember this one. If I recognize one of the tracks after this, like I'd be surprised. I don't think so. Though. I, I think I never probably beat that one. I probably didn't try that hard. <laughs> it's like fucking Darius going on in the background now. I can tell you that much. Man, the deaths in this game are just like, when you die, because you're moving so fast, I just don't see it coming. I was playing this the other day, and all of a sudden, I die, like, all of a sudden I just hit a tree, and I was dead. And it was like, alive, dead. That, that's how you die in this game. It's not like, oh my god, I'm gonna crash, here I go, oh my god, boom. It's not like that at all. This game is like, I'm driving along dead. That's F Zero GX. Like when you when you're fucking dead, it's like a nanosecond, and you fucking die. Less than a fucking nanosecond, like less than less than time, is how quick you will die. That's my scientific explanation for you, less than time. Doc Brown would understand what I was saying. He, he would get it. Great Scott, less than time. How could it be possible? Ooh, there's 
a fun course too. I, I like. I think I like this one. I like it in the original game too. Sand Ocean. And then there's, you know, what one I liked a lot. I wonder, if, uh, Red Canyon. I think is, there's one called. Is this, is, okay, there's one more left. That one I love, the Red Canyon. Pretty sure that was the name of that track. I wonder if there's a Red Canyon in this. Let's see. Da -da 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 -da. And just so you know, this is my first time on the uh, Diamond Cup here, so I'm on the easier setting here, you know, and I'll, I'm going to gradually work my way up. I'm trying to do, like, all everything. So this is our first time seeing Diamond Cup, and then I'm going to move up to Standard and then Expert. Like, we'll, we'll get there. One thing at a time I got to do. It's good to do it like this, though. It gets me used to the, you know, levels. All right. So that's that. How do I feel about Wind Waker? I like Wind Waker. It's good. I liked it back then. Um, I like I like the colorful, cartoony like style of Zelda, and I like it also on the Switch how they did it with um, Link's the new Link's Awakening. How it has like almost that claymation kind of style to it. I think that's great. I think it's perfect for Zelda. Go back and remember the original Zelda. Remember Link to the Past. Those are colorful games. I think Zelda should be colorful. Your brother always called it Wind Wanker. Yeah. Well, that was the uh, like prototype name, you know, like the original, like the dolphin, you know. Miyamoto did uh, several inter interviews about that, and they were like, uh, "Was Wind Wanker always the title?" And they're like, "He was like, no, uh, it was Wind Wanker at first. Um, actually, the original name was just Wanker. Then it was Wind Wanker. You know, wanking off in the wind." Firefield again. Jamie Rose says, used to have this game, but only could get as far as the casino race and story mode. Okay. I don't know. Uh, did I do that in story mode yet? I don't know how far I am in story mode. Oh, is that the green stage that I was talking about that I like? Is that, is, I wonder if that's the one he's talking about. If that's the one you're talking about, I, I beat that. It was that is a tough thing to do, um, so don't feel bad. I, I, I had to try it a bunch to get finally get by that, and I fuck right into the fire. Um, I really like that level. I was talking about that. Yeah, I saw you beat it. Okay, so uh, we are talking about the same one. Yeah, I like that one a lot. You know why? I was confused because there's another like casino level in the actual like tracks where it's kind of like darker. And there's like a clown and shit. Um, so I think, I guess there's like a couple different casino. What is it, like a fucking casino planet or something? Is that where they got the idea for The Last Jedi? Did they rip off like F-Zero GX for like the fucking casino world? Except they made it like really shitty with that one guy who's like <laughs> that fucking awful, nobody wants that. And those fucking, like, what even, what were those animals? Those stupid animals running through the fucking casino? I'm not talking about that movie anymore. Now we're done, because now I don't want to think about that movie. It didn't happen. It didn't, it doesn't exist. You got boost power. Did I get him? I think I did. Oh, fuck! 
Oh boy. Oh god. Oh god. Now I gotta get all the way to, to where there's gonna be health. I think it's far away. I have three can, uh, lives though, so should be alright. If I dial. Oh god. Oh god. Is it coming? Is it coming? Yes! It's almost full. Isn't there another one? Or is that the only one? I thought there was two. Oh, yeah, there, there is two. Ha ha. God. This shit. Oh! Thundercats! This music's awesome, too. Should have some of these tracks for break the break animation. I always think that emote is funny, that Kalicious. And I fuck right into the fire. That's metal. True that they're getting George to go back to the Star Wars, the new Star Wars. Oh my God! <laughs> do I have the clip on here still? I think I got rid of the clip. Wait, do I have it? Let's see. I don't think I have the clip on here anymore. Would make it worse. It's just like, just give it up. Give the whole fucking thing up. Christ. It's like, you had the original trilogy, good. And then he came back, and then people were like, fuck Jar Jar Banks, and fuck all this, like, midichlorians, and people hated that shit. And then we got through that, and then it was like, all right, let's just all forget that that happened. And then they come out with this new fucking trilogy, and then that fucking sucks even worse. Somehow. It's even worse. Worse than Jar Jar Banks, even. And now we're like, just, we're just like, everybody's just like, Jesus fucking Christ, just stop already. And then they're like, oh, well, maybe if we get George Luke. Yeah, that's the answer, because he did such a good fucking job before. You know? The fucking Jar Jar Banks or whatever. Jesus fucking Christ, just stop. Just stop. Stop making it. Stop making all the Star Wars shit. Stop making all Star Wars shit. Stop making all the Star Trek shit. Just stop making it. But they can't. They can't stop making it because money. And honestly, I don't. I kind of don't blame them though. It's like, really, if you could make like a billion fucking dollars, it's like fuck it. <laughs> I, want, I want a billion dollars too. I get it. I get it. You know. I, I, I understand when somebody's like, hey, we can make a bunch of shitty movies and you can get a billion dollars. I'd be like, great, make them. I want the billion dollars. Go ahead. You know? Just sign the fuck, give me the check. Make the movies. I don't fucking care. So I understand. They just don't care. They just want money. That's all it is. And that, that's fine. I understand that. I would do the same thing, by the way. I'd do the same exact shit. Be like, oh yeah, put, put a fucking Jar Jar Banks tongue hanging out, whatever. I don't care. Anything can happen. Doesn't matter. People are gonna go see the movies, and I'm gonna get paid. Make, just keep making them. Keep fucking making them. So I get it. They're terrible, but I understand. And and I and I'm telling you, I'm no better. I would do the exact same shit exact same shit. Send the check. Send me the fucking check.
This is a cool course, by the way. you hit those top ones like that you probably by also using a speed boost thing or something and having the right like trajectory on your car or something I don't know this is like a kind of ice sort of an icy surface slick slick shoes says you can't tell me Ford didn't know it was trash. Well, how much did he get fucking paid for that? You think he fucking cares? He went out and bought himself a bunch of fucking planes. He's like, yeah, I'm gonna buy a plane. <laughs> what do I gotta do? So, show up on set for, you know, a week? That's great. <laughs> he's, like, he's like, I want a new plane. What do I gotta do? Oh, okay, here we go. What, what's the line? Hang on. Uh, Hang on, let me get my glasses. Okay. All right, here we go. Ready? Chewy, we're home. Can I get my check? Deliver the, uh, please deliver the plane to my driveway. Thank you. <laughs> I don't blame them. I do the same shit. Harrison Ford made the best dishes and killed me off in this shit. Yeah, but he, did you see the, the, the newer one? Uh... The one that, the last one that came out, the, uh, the one that has the emperor in it, unfortunately, uh, I don't remember the name of it, but the new one that came out, he's in it, he's in it, he fuck, he's fucking, he's in there, he needed, he needed another plane, you know? For 20 seconds, you know, you know how much he probably fucking got like millions of dollars being in there for like two seconds. As if Harrison Ford doesn't have his own hangar. Yeah. Oh yeah, absolutely. Every Star Wars movie, he buys himself another airplane hangar full of fucking planes. <laughs> oh look at this shit. Okay, this doesn't ring a bell either. I don't think I've ever seen, I don't think I ever went this far. So yeah, I think I'm further now in this game than I played it when I was, uh, when, when it came out. So that's what, that, that, I know that doesn't matter to you guys. It just matters to me because I would, you know, it was interesting to me. I'm like, how far did I play this game back then? So I think we're now further than, and this is really cool too, than I played before. I don't remember this one. Oh my god. This is really cool. So this is like kind of like Rainbow Road or something, huh? It is the road, it is the Rainbow Road. It is the road that you go. Mario Princess and the Toad. Fuck 
kind of sweet. I like it a lot. <laughs> The final lap. I wonder, is it the same fucking announcer guy that was from Monkey Ball? I wonder if it's the same voice. To compare it side by side or something. Anybody know? Is it the same announcer dude? It's probably somebody different, right? That'd be funny if it, if it was the same thing. Base since it's almost the same staff. Anybody want to look it up and try to figure it out? Did I see that there will be Indiana Jones 5 with Harrison Ford? Yeah, they've been talking about it since for, you know, forever. So. There's a bunch of monkey ball stuff in custom car mode. Is there? That's funny. You put like a dull banana on there. I played a little bit of it, uh, J Dog. It's pretty cool. I got an autograph. Let's do this. May I have your autograph, champ? I'll write it with homemade ink. I'd like to present this autograph. That's his autograph. On F Zero TV. Here's the address. <laughs> what the fuck? Good, everyone. This game is fucking bizarre. <laughs> I'll write it with homemade ink. Basically, he shot ink out of his asshole onto the piece of paper. The dude's like, yo, don't do that. That's my paper. All right, um. I have, probably have to, I have to do that first, okay. All right, let's look at the um, story mode. And I unlocked another thing. Can I go back and see what we've, yeah. So I've done chapter one, chapter two, this was on the boulders, high stakes in Mute City. This is the one where you're knocking guys out, I think. This is that race with the doors kind of closing. This is the one where that like, kind of bomb blows up with like speed, and this is the one we're on. So I think the one I like is, is it the high stakes in Mute City? I'm gonna try this really quickly, just cause um, I just wanna say, I'm, if this is the track I really like a lot. Just skip that shit. I think it, um, it probably is. It, just start the fucking. I, I'm not actually gonna play it right now. I just want to like see if this is what it is. Yeah, yeah, this level. It is. I, I really like this level a lot. Oh, I can't use the. By the way, I can't use the um, octopus guy on this now. I guess. I don't. I don't know. I just. I love this fucking track. This is so fun. Like, I think that this is, like, top-notch fucking, like, level design here. Anyway, um, oh, I want to do the new one, though, right now. It's only Captain Falcon and Story. After you beat Story Mode, can you, like, use, can you go through Story Mode again with, like, other characters? No? Okay, so it's just him. Okay. 
All right, this is the new thing. Become a Grand Prix champion. All right, let's see if I can win it. Falcon's your favorite, so you never mind it anyway, yeah. I gotta use Octoman, though. I mean, come on, jeez. This is like a mute city, but like with lava around, huh? Pretty much. Oh, oh. Huh. <laughs> All right, it's gonna take a while. This course is nuts. Shit. All right. I like the mute city levels a lot too. compare this difficulty wise to Mario Kart um uh ask me that after I beat master <laughs> come back after that point and ask me again I'll answer your question basically ask me after I complete the game and do the fuck I'll do everything Cause it's like, I don't, I can't really answer that yet, you know? But I mean, this is a much faster, like, I, this is, my answer is gonna be that this is a harder game. Like, there's already shit in this game harder than, and it depends what Mario Kart you're talking about. You just said like Mario, like what, which Mario Kart? Mario Kart 8? Like, this game's harder than Mario Kart 8, if that's what you're wondering. Like, because I, I did 200cc or whatever on Mario Kart 8. Um, but that's not really, that's not where the challenge comes in with Mario Kart, though. That, with Mario Kart, the challenge comes in with playing other people, like playing real players. So it's like, that's a different thing. So, I mean, if you're playing real people, then it's as hard as you make it. You know, so it's not really. But if you want to talk about like the computer fucking shit, the computer mode versus like the sing, you know, the single player modes, the, this is a harder game. Mario Kart has bullshit difficulty. Mar uh, Mario Kart is bullshit because Mario Kart does. Um, uh, like I, my favorite Super Nintendo game is Super Mario Kart. And it's bullshit, though. So I can say that. It's my favorite Super Nintendo game, but it's fucking bullshit. Because Nintendo does that stuff where it's like, oh, the person's in last place. Better give them a lightning bolt. If you're in first place, they're not giving you a lightning bolt. But if you're in eighth place, they'll give you, like, a fucking lightning bolt. That's just, like, making the game, giving the game, like, a curve. And that's just, like, one example you know, they'll do other shit like that. Like, if you're in fifth place, they'll give you, you know, shit to catch up. And it's like, no. It should be... It should be skill fucking based. You know? But Nintendo does that bullshit. Where it's like, oh, they can't, you know, don't want anybody to lose too badly. It's like, no. You should fucking... It should, you should be able to... If you're not good enough, then you lose. So that's something I don't like about Mario Kart. When they, when they do that... Um, there's probably a term for it. Um, when they curve the difficulty like that because you suck, like I don't agree with that at all. Like get, like and practice and get better. You don't just get to fucking win. What the fuck is that? You know? Why fucking even play then? They fucking hand you it. You know? Fuck that shit. So that's that's the that's the probably the main thing about Mario Kart that bothers me. 
and they and they do it in, in my in my favorite one in the Super Mario Kart one they do it in, I think they do it in all of them and that's Nintendo bullshit right there by the way they also do that shit in fucking Mario Party pisses me off you'll be playing like fucking Mario Party and it'll do that like oh uh, the other guy landed on the miracle spot or some fucking like really good like the star spot or you know something like really you know that, that'll have him catch up at the last second or, like it's just fucking it's horse shit it's fucking horse shit the stuff they do I don't agree with it it's not like that's not fair you should, it should be fucking based on skill not fucking luck yeah. I'm 30th right now, by the way. So this is not going well at all. It's not, at least I'm not dead yet. I will be in a second. I'm just jinxing myself saying that. Or rubber band mechanics. That makes sense. Rubber band AI, is that what they call it? Handicap for the people in the lower places, right. Comeback mechanics. Nintendo wholesomeness, yeah. I knew, I knew people who would purposely hang back to get the catch-up lightning bolt and then pass people. Oh, yeah, that's, see, yeah, that's bullshit. That's some bullshit. Mario Kart is supposed to be bullshit? I guess so. I mean, it's always it's always been since the first game, so I guess it, I guess it is supposed to be, you know. Yeah, but I mean, I still I still like Mario Kart though. Like, I, I love Mario Kart. It's fun. Um, that's like when you're playing with, um, you know. But no, actually, no, it happens like, no, never mind. I was, I was going to say something, but no, never mind. Um, yeah, no, it's like always bullshit. It's always fucking bullshit. O always bullshit things happening in Mario Kart. It's, a, it's very bullshitty. It's weird, like, it's like, I probably shouldn't like it, but I do. Like, I love, I love Mario Kart, but it, but I'm admitting that it's fucking bullshit. God damn, what the fuck is this? What is this? Look at this, look at this, look at this! How is this happening? What the hell was that? The fuck? I've never seen something like that. <laughs> what is my favorite console of all time? Uh, I really, truly love um, the Philips CDI. Um, and people might think I'm like kidding right now, but no, I love the Philips CDI, and I really love... Um, I love the uh, Tetris on there. It's great. It's good. No, really, though, um, I don't know. My favorite console? Like, probably NES. You know? It's hard to beat the NES. Um, shit. I love the GameCube. You know? It's got fucking Monkey Ball and F Zero fucking GX. Like, what else do you need besides that? Uh, I don't know, I like playing shit on fucking Steam. There's a lot of good shit on Steam. I like PC gaming. Uh, I 
mean, Super Nintendo is great. Sega Genesis is great. I don't know. But if I was, if I'm hard pressed to pick, probably the NES. Probably that probably has something to do with you know growing up with it and playing it so much. You know, because I grew up with the NES. That was what I played more of than anything else. So I probably just know it more. Um, but um, you know what though? I really like the PC Engine a lot. Honestly, if I grew up with the PC Engine, like I wonder if I would like that the best. Because I love the PC Engine now. It's just that I didn't have that growing up. So I have no like real nostalgia for it, or not much at least. I mean, I see like commercials on TV and shit, like you know, terrible graphics and a lot. But like, I, yeah, I like I love that too. Um, so I don't know. Motherfucker, this is tough. Made it far that time. Shit. Also, like the Hyperscan is a great console. If you really want top tier the gaming, Hyperscan. Um, you know, without a doubt. Our zone, our zone's pretty cool. Um, the RDI Alk Scion or whatever, that one's great. It's good. In seriousness, in seriousness, though, I do like the Sega Saturn a lot, I, uh, and, the, and the Dreamcast. I've been finding a lot of stuff on there. Like um, Saturn's great for shmups, I think. Like, I'm, I'm not being sarcastic now. I actually really I like the Saturn a lot. Um, what else? There's some cool games on like 3DO, uh, like Star Control on 3DO is like really good, but like I don't know too many games on 3DO that are good. Fucking just blow up, blow up. I should be killing these guys, huh? And that's the problem because I'm not getting. Oh, that's great. This is gonna take me a hundred tries. Um, besides like Star Control, what's like really good on like 3DO? Like I don't really even know. Both Saturn and Dreamcast had cool shmups in fighting games. DOS, DOS, yeah, DOS. Row Rash, mm. Will I do a Virtual Boy stream? I mean, I don't know how I would do it. How I'd, I don't know. Emulate it, yeah. I don't, uh, I don't know. I guess I I would emulate it. I don't know. What's up, Gruth Call? Oh, 
But I didn't even fucking mention like Neo Geo. Like Neo Geo is fucking awesome. Like I don't know. I like it fucking all the like. That's why I don't like like I don't like the question. What's your like? What's your favorite? Why like just there's so many good things on so many good systems. Like I like PS4. I like PS1. Like there's good shit and bad shit on everything. I'll play fucking games on a fucking emulator. Like, I'll play, like, arcade games on a fucking emulator. Like, uh, there's fun things to be found everywhere. And there's just garbage to be found everywhere. Like, that's the real answer. people ask you what your favorite console is, you give a different answer every time. That's what I'm going to do. From now on, just a different answer. Genesis is my favorite. Ask me tomorrow, I'm going to say Dreamcast. And then uh, ask me the day after, I'm going to say Neo Geo. I'm just going to change it every time. I'm just going to start changing my favorite answers from now on. I'm just going to make anything up. You guys already know my favorites of everything. Because I've answered those questions. Like, I've said my favorite uh, everything that exists at this point. You know what? I've answered that before, too. The end gauge. Yeah, I have an I have an end gauge sitting around somewhere. Nokia. And the Neo Geo Pocket Color. That's what I'm gonna say. When somebody asks me my favorite system tomorrow, that's what I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say Neo Geo Pocket Color. That's my that's tomorrow's answer. Yeah, Neo Geo Pocket Color. It's the best. It's the best. It's the only thing I like to play. The real question is, will I ever beat this fucking course? I don't think I will. I think I am doomed to do this course over and over and over.
I don't even know if I, when I was killing these guys, if they were giving health back. Like, maybe I wasn't killing them. Like, right there. There. It was like I killed three dudes right there. Did I get health back there? See those fucking skulls lining up? There we go. Look! What? How did that happen? I was doing good that time. Come on! game gave you the fuck you. It did. It definitely did. Fuck, man. I'm gonna beat this fucking level! Ah! Look, look, look at this. Everybody's crashing into me. Fuckers. Don't the fucking god! Come on! Fuck Grover? Yeah, fuck him. Fuck Rover. Grover can go fuck himself. Fuck Ernie, too. Fuck them all. Fuck all those motherfuckers. Is there Sesame Street racing? There should be Sesame Street fucking, like, F-Zero. <laughs> the yellow car, the fucking uh, Golden Fox. That's Big Bird. I think it's called Golden Fox, right? Fuck Grover's Captain Falcon. Oscar the Grouch is that green fucking car. Who am I missing? The Stingray. Oh, you know who the fucking Stingray is. The fucking, uh, fucking Elmo. <laughs> no, fuck that. It's Telly. Fuck, Grover's not in the game. Or fucking, uh, what's his name? El Elmo's not in the game. Fuck Elmo. Get him out of my fucking game. It's fucking Telly. Elmo's on the title screen, chained up. He's not allowed to fucking drive. getting his own HBO talk show. That's not the real Elmo, though. That's fucking fake Elmo. It's a fucking... He's being framed. E.T. What's up with E.T.? Shadow try to kill you. Blood Falcon. So apparently somebody's saying in the chat that on some of the harder levels with this, uh, like later, there's racers that try to aggressively kill you on top of this. Oh, great. Great. I got a lot to look forward to here.
27th. At least I'm not dead yet. the graph. <laughs> Fuck. Do you have to come in first? Shit. Do you have to come in fucking first on this? Got a raid from Movie Gaming TV. Thank you, Movie Gaming TV. So, uh, you're, I mean, you're entering me doing a level over and over and over here. This is very hard. Uh, but thank you, Movie Gaming TV, for the raid. You do have to do first. All right. Uh, so I'm playing F-Zero GX. I'm doing story mode at the moment. And I'm doing this Mute City Grand Prix. And it's nuts. i doing it over and over and over. It's really hard to do. These racers you get knocked off, you fall off the track. Any number of things can happen. So. so it is a problem. That's the, po that, that was the uh, Pokemon guy that I call the Pokemon. I just passed him. I might, have I might have, no, I didn't kill him, but. Or Oregon or whatever. my energy to get through this because they're going to be slamming into me. Bunch of fuckers. 20 Christ. This is a really hard one. That's what she said. But I'm bummed. Stupid. Doesn't even tell you what place you took? That was probably like third or something. God damn it. Oh, sixth? Better there, a little bit better. So I'll try this a few more times, but then I might go back to Grand Prix, do more, because I gotta get through the fucking expert Grand Prix shit, too, so, this might take me a while, that was, I saw him, I saw the Pokemon guy, fuck, I wanted to, just trying to slam into the fucker, oh man, I don't know, alright, tell you what, I'll come back to this, that's crazy, Let's do, uh, I want to beat, beat another expert thing, maybe. Let's try if I did expert in Sapphire Cup, because I got F expert in Ruby. Let's do expert in Sapphire, see if I can do that. If you're not first, you're last. All right, big blue. This is a cool level.
I gotta make it through all this part. I'm fucked. Uh, maybe not. What was that? Fucking seventh or something? A sixteenth? Ha! <laughs> Fuck. Okay. Shit. <laughs> Fucking hell. Alright, let's try that again. God damn it. God damn it. Am I playing this on original hardware? Yes. take first and this one. I mean, I would maybe continue if I got like second or third, but like, really, I want for first place. Oh man, oh man, oh man, not good. Not good at all. Look at this, 28. probably worse even worse I don't like it you yeah, can't hit start and just fucking like you gotta go through all this this is the penalty for losing is what this is then you go to that I wish like at any point you could hit start and get out of it that's one, that's one thing that bothers me, bothers me. Try a different racer. Expert's pretty brutal in this game. Yeah, it's getting it's getting hard. Here. Oops. God damn it. 
I know I'm gonna fucking not take the first and just like restart there. I sh I'm gonna I should I'm gonna try uh, somebody else. I'm gonna try with Blue Falcon. F Zero JX is amazing. It's, it's a challenging game. I think it'd be cool if you could shoot lasers or have guns. I don't know. You can, I mean, you can take people out. Like, you can sideswipe them. Like, how much do you want? You shoot like fucking the fucking BFG like nine thousand at the motherfuckers. Like, make F Zero Doom. I think that's going to be a better car, though. Brought to you by the letter F. That is right. That is right. It, it stands for funky. It stands for funky. That's right. Thank you, a Ghost Hentai Prince, for the uh, for the host. We got a host from the ghost. <laughs> Fuck. The host, space ghost with the most. Thank you, Grim Sight. seven minutes before it lets me come with the start option to get back to the fucking thing. No! God damn it! This is what's gonna make me throw the fucking controller through the fucking window. Come on! Oh my god. That, that kind of shit is what fucking really sets me off.
couldn't hit the fucking start before the fucking thing ended. Oh, it's driving me fucking crazy now. I can't stand that. I can't hit start right now. Let me hit start right now and have the fucking screen come up so I can quit. Oh my god, if they do put this on Switch, I hope they fucking change that. That's the one thing I want different. I'm gonna need practice on like the next track too, because I don't even fucking remember what it is. I'm gonna have to come back through. Let's try this next track and see what this is fucking gonna be like. Fuck me. I'm probably gonna have to know how to balance every between every fucking thing too, to get the right like balance. Shit. Fuck me. I'm just going just because. Anyway. I killed one guy. I kill all these motherfuckers. Maybe I can win by knocking some of these cocks out of the fucking race. Fucking cocksuckers. Kill them all. I'll fucking kill them all. That's what I'll fucking do. Fucking kill him! Do you get slower in this when you're like low, low power energy like this? Oh shit, I missed that. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Alright. 
past the rival. Oh, fuck you! Damn it! You do not go slower, okay. I think the Super Nintendo one you do though, right? Damn! Racers, that was nice. That'll never happen again. All you need to really kill is him, though. If I fucking kill his ass. Fuck you. win now. One more, right? All right. That's one. Let's go for it. Damn it. on the thing. Fucker. What place am I in now? Fifth? Oh, this is not going well. Who's the motherfucker? Golden Fox. Fucking Golden Fox. Well, the point value is not that crazy different, though. Maybe I can, maybe I can do this yet. We'll see. We'll see. The golden fox. Man, I don't know. Actually, if I... I don't know what to choose. Sylvester Stallone F-Zero game. 
should have broke your thumbs. I'll take, I'll take that second, right? I'll take that. Whatever I can get. Rambo F-Zero. He used the lightning bolt. <laughs> Dr. Stewart. No, Dr. Stewart. All right. I took second there, so how's this going? Look at this, though. Look at this shit here. I'm in first place right now. Who the fuck's in first place right now? Me. Me. Let's all remember this because when I am not in first place in a moment, I'll be crying. So I know Bloodhawk, he's a problem. Thank you, Nightfish X2, for subbing with Twitch Prime. If you guys have Amazon Prime, you can support this wonderful channel of mine where I yell at racing games from 18 years ago. <laughs> Thank you, though. I appreciate it. Go, Blue Falcon. Dynamut. Seventeen years. Port Wine Town. Here we go. Go! some kind of crazy shit I was saying about this well yesterday too. Now I'm talking about Sesame Street race and I was saying some other fucking thing about this level. I don't remember what it was. Does anybody remember from my last stream what I said <laughs> about this level? I don't remember what the hell I was talking about. God damn it. I'll never remember. Ninja Turtles. Oh my god, that's right. Gino. That's exactly what I was talking about. I think I was saying something like this would be if there was like a Ninja Turtles F Zero game. This would be like a race inside the Technodrome or something? Is that what I was saying? Something like that. Forget the whole thing. And my car would be. See, I was using the other guy though. I was using the red dude, so I was like Raphael, right? Which I can remember. I don't know, we got a whole thing about that. Oh, and April O'Neil would be the yellow car. Because she's, you know, she 
wears the fucking yellow banana raincoat. So she'd be, what's his name, Dr. Stewart? Dr. Stewart? So I took first there. I might do this. I might, I might beat the expert. See, it's a good thing that I continued after. I couldn't fucking take first on that first track. But I'm, there's one, is that, was that the last one or is there one more? Because, see now, look at this. Is there one more? I think there's one more after this. All right, oh, this fucking one though. This is the one with the fuck Olaf, right? Oh my god, Olaf. All right, I have a chance. I could possibly do the expert on this. I have a... Uh... How many lives I have, I wonder? Perhaps three lives. All right, so... This one's easy to die, though. That's the problem, so... Let's see. Olaf or whatever coming. I'm 30th. This is great. This is going real well. Shit, pickles. I'm gonna need it too. if I actually landed on that fucking thing. Shit. This is not good. wonder if the, the game would even like allow something like that. See, I told you, it's like you're going dead. It's like that, that's this game. You're driving, you're dri dead. It's immediately, it's fucking nuts. Fuck, make it please, no! This is my last one, right? Great, great, great! Oh, this is a fucking shit show. Oh, I'm hitting bombs. I'm hitting the bombs. I'm hitting all the bombs. I'm hitting the bombs. Oh my god, I almost just went off the fucking edge right there. You better make it. This is 
gonna take me the rest of my life to get through this game. Oh, this is getting hard now, man. Oh my god. So what have I done in this? Like... Did I do all the... No, I gotta do fucking standard in that. Oh, I got so much to do left. Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. And imagine getting through Expert on that. Oh my god. Expert on Emerald. That'll be the rest of the year. I'll be streaming this the rest of the year to try to get through this. Fuck, Mike, I know that pain too well. Yeah, oh my god, this is crazy. Give this one more try for now. <clears throat> let's do uh, let's do this. Oh fuck! No, no, go back. I gotta put him on expert. Here, All right, expert. One, one, one last try with this. Try another pilot. It's not a bad idea. I know that he's like he's going fast enough. I don't know. I'm probably not gonna do it right here, but I'll, I'll come back to it later when I when I fail here. All right, so it's gonna be my last attempt, and then I'm gonna stop. What was I take 17 last time? 15? I'll take it. I'll, I'm taking 15. It's fine. We're moving on. I, I don't fucking know how I can do that one. How do you take first in that one? Alright, Port Town. Show me moves! There's Rob the Robot. All right, um, I don't know. Take some of these guys out by killing them. The fuckers are fucking slamming into me. I'm slamming into them. Oh 
don't know. I hope to God I can make the next thing. I can't slam into anybody now. Not good. Oh no! What the fuck's gonna happen here? This is bad. This is real bad. Fuck you. Can't use up too much life. Oh god, there he goes. <clears throat> oh no. God, I'm making a major risk right here. time. Fuck. I'm fucked. I don't know. I mean, maybe if I can knock... See, before I knocked the, the rival out, right? That's what fucking helped me. I gotta fucking do that here, I guess. I don't know. Fuck. I gotta, I gotta take this motherfucker out. Here. Did I get him? <laughs> no, knock him. Oh, you asshole. Ah. Oh, that two dad. Did I get him, actually? I wonder if he was one of the ones or not. Never know. If I got him, then uh, I might still have a chance. It's hard to hit these fucks. All right, one more. Mm -hmm. I'll just save all this shit for a minute. Oh, I forgot there was that there. I shouldn't have saved it. Save nothing. There should be a little bit more uh, that. Oh my god. Come on! Fucking shit! I hope that guy that just came in first was like in 30th before. This is just bad. Alright, I'm in fifth. Well, okay, so, well, how far ahead is this mother? Oh my god. Yeah, this is just going really badly. So I have to take this green fucking panther guy out for sure. I have to kill green, I have to kill this rival. So this is going really badly. Damn it. Fuck, fuck, fuck. I did better than the last time. Let's restart it.
front of me right now. Aren't I? see anything going on in this fucking course. I guess. I did. I, I mean, he's. I haven't seen. Oh, there! No, there he is. Fuck! I thought he was fucking dead or something. Motherfucker! I'm not gonna get the chance to do it. Fuck you! Oh my god! It's like because if I don't take him out, it's like. Here, fuck. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna retire this. Let's see if I, I, I have to take him out. He has to die. I'm gonna beat the next fucking stage anyway, so it's like whatever, you know? Oh. Imagine if I would've hit that. Come here, come here. All right, he's, he's hanging out all the way in the back here. Bastard, oh my God, I'm so close to him. Where is he? Good luck seeing anything when this is going on. There. Damn it! This is like worst stage. There, I'm close to him. Come on! I hit the fucking wall! Damn it! He fucking just boosted because he's like, oh, I'm gonna get fucking slammed by fucking Mike here. He knew it. He fucking did that. He knows I'm after him. Fucking! Fucking asshole. I don't know. But fucking there, there he goes, too. Yeah, and now look how fast he's going. He would see he's like hanging in the back so that I can't fucking get him. Now he's going fast as fucking shit and I can't even catch his ass. Fucking piece of shit. He knows what he's doing. For sure. Did I just get him? No. It's like I can I think I can take first in this one, but it's not bad. It's like knocking him out too. Come on, pass me. I'm letting you I'm letting you pass me. Go ahead. Go ahead, douchebag. Fuck 
and whatever. Now I just want to win it. I sacrifice that. I sacrifice first place because I'm trying to blow his ass up and I couldn't fucking get him. I don't know. It's, I'm, it's fucked. I can't do it. What place am I in? Second. I sure just went for first there. I don't know. I mean, it's still possible. I, 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 should, I, I should really just go for first and just try to win it. Instead of, I'm not gonna focus on like knocking him out here because I can't even fucking get, like I can't even do this fucking race on this. There's, this level's like really hard. I'm just gonna try to make it. That's all I'm focused on here, just making it. And by the way, I'm in t fucking 29th place. It's great. Oh, this is where you fell off. It's a fucking miracle I need. Oh, got that though. I just hit that at the fucking last second because I would have lost. Did you see where I hit the start button? Somebody clipped that. That was the best thing I did the whole night was hitting the fucking pause right there. Oh, that, I'll take that. That was better than anything the whole night. Somebody please clip that. I got to see that shit. That was the best moment. <laughs> Holy shit. I, like, I wonder like, if I can tell the timing on that or something. Like, when that, that exactly paused. Oh, I'm gonna fucking die. Oh, wait, maybe not. Maybe not. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah! Uh. Oh, the challenge of your rival. Motherfucker! It's doing all right for a second. Shit. Oh, was that? Oh, I didn't know. I didn't know the life. Oh, I didn't know. I thought I had like, I thought I had like two more lives. Fuck. All right. Well, I'm gonna stop for now then. Damn it. I'm, I'm gonna come back to this. Um, this is so much fun. I love this fucking game. Um, I'll I'll come back to. It. We'll, I'll get through it eventually. I need to do the earlier courses like. Um, get like. Uh, I need to do better earlier on. Um, 
but anyway, we'll, we'll play this more later. It's, this is such a fun game. I love it. F Zero GX. You guys gotta play it. Anyway, all right, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you guys later. Thanks for the subs and the follows and the follows and the subs and the subbing and the follows and all that stuff. All right, guys. See you later. Bye.